Fellas! Should I make some coffee? I actually don't know. Coffee or tea? What do we think? Ugh, come on. Coffee or tea? Coffee or tea? Council has decided. T. Welcome everybody. Hello, it's me. Um, how's your day going? Welcome. I decided to go for tea because uh, usually I always go for coffee. And I actually already had coffee earlier today, so we do a little change. Okay, so if you know nothing about Illbleed, good. 
that's gonna make everything a lot better. Trust me, it's a game... You, like... It's... I, I Like, I can't find the words to describe this game. You guys... I mean, if you love Yakuza, you're gonna love just how weird this game is. That's all I'm gonna say, without saying too much. And I think we have at least one person in the chat that does know this game, so... No spoilers, fellas. Let's keep it fresh for those who didn't watch this game at all. It's, uh... It's, uh... It's something. But yeah, October has started, and that means I will be... Hopefully doing more horror games this month. I really want to. There's a lot of gems out there waiting to be played, and this game is one of them. I want to make at least one playthrough of this game. Um, and yeah, it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome. Does it have a shirtless man? It has shirtless men, even. And sometimes women, too. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see about that later. Okay, so let me just put up the game. Um... I was really thinking about whether I wanted to make this, like, a widescreen resolution, or... Uh, 4 to 3 resolution, whatever you want to call it. I think I'll make it 4 to 3. But... Okay, uh... I think... Hold on, let me just make sure it's going okay. It'll bleed... Let me turn off that music for Yakuza 0. Also, let me make sure the volume is not gonna blast all of you guys. Okay, I think we're good to go. It'll bleed. It'll bleed, fellas. Okay, hold on. Let me just fix the small inconsistency. There, I think this is gonna look better. No, wait. I think that's better. No, there we go. There we go. Okay. Welcome, fellas. Ill bleed. Um, if you heard nothing about this game, don't worry about it. We'll all uh, get to see what it's about. And trust me, if you're having a bad day or something, uh, it will change with this game. <laughs> also, is the volume okay for you guys? called a horror caravan. We hauled this house of horrors around from town to town, trying to give people a new thrill, a new nightmare. I kind of like traveling, but all that gruesome gore got to me after a while. Gruesome. Oh, the lore. My dad was always conjuring up new I think this devices, should be better. tricks, and traps, each one scarier than the last. <laughs> Guess who we tried them out on? Yep, me. No! 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 I guess it toughened me up a little. I mean, you have to be brave to walk through a den of snakes or yeah, this is the guide to better. trap doors to make it to your room. I was a pretty fearless kid by the time I was five, thanks to my fearsome father. He fed on others' fears. And was never satisfied. What's happening? My mom couldn't Just listen. understand how obsessed he'd gotten, <laughs> so she thankfully divorced him when I was six. Yet thankfully, I had gotten attached to horror. 
I remember how that good old Halloween pillow and a hot red water bath soothed me. I think I might major in child psychology. Hmm. All right. So, how'd I do? Erico Christie. That was great. I mean, you're the head of the horror research club and president of the student council. It's Brock. It's a given. <laughs> you win this speech contest for sure. Kevin and Randy. What, Michelle? Why didn't you listen to Erico's speech? I don't need to. I know she'll win. Here, take a look at this. Those are guest invitations. It's the game really? name. How'd you get them? From a pet. Yo, assassination. Kill. Kill. We can win a hundred million bucks there. <laughs> yeah, if we can manage to get through the whole park, that is. No sweat. I'm game if you are. Michelle. Sure thing. I'm with you. Whoa! 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 <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> what about you, Erico? I think I'll pass. It sounds too good to be true. Why? You just said in your speech to conquer your fear and surpass the odds. Come on, we can test your theory. Sounds like we're trying to be superheroes or something. It's no big <laughs> Just a house of horrors. Probably full of cheesy props and gags. Which proves what's so weird about this. How can a funky place like that afford a hundred million dollar reward? Who knows? Maybe they'll make it take so long to get through it. Everyone will give up, go home, and the horror honchos will end up with a lot of free publicity. Or else the whole thing is a hoax. And they don't have the money at all. I agree with him. I'm down with that. I'm not voting. Or going. For real? Are you positive? You sure? You sure? Yep, <laughs> you heard me. Okay, your highness. Then we three humble slaves shall bring back the 100 million dollars and you'll be sorry. I can't wait to commune with the undead. What is this I music? Need money for a chainsaw. A chainsaw? Yeah, my way to fame and fear. <laughs> what kind of oh, chainsaw is 400 million dollars? Okay then. We'll catch you later, Eric. What's the music? Don't worry, Let's it gets go. better. <laughs> few days later. <clears throat> Excuse me, did you see three high school kids around here three days ago? They had special invites. <laughs> the subtitles. <laughs> yep, got it buddy, thank you. <laughs> uh, an amusement park in the middle of nowhere. Yo, Swaggy, how you doing? <clears throat> okay, here we go. Uh, yeah, it's just like that one sub story. <clears throat> okay, here we go. El bleed. I'm actually... Mm, I think at the moment he can't really go anywhere, so I'm gonna go and um, enter one of the stages. Just to check, is the volume mix okay here? Is the music too loud? Or is it just okay? A little loud. Okay, hold on. Let me take it to... this. I have a save that I made earlier, like, 
a long time ago, actually, but I never finished the game, so... Gonna save on it. Why not? <clears throat> I'm assuming now it's better. Well, we'll find out when I go outside. That's when it gets kind of loud. I think it's better now, right? It should be. Still a bit loud. Okay, hold on. I'll take it back to what it was originally then. There. <laughs> I think... Yeah, I think I heard about that gamer. Okay, so... You might be wondering, what the fuck is this game? So, with this game... What was the button again? Hold on. Yeah, so... You have these movies in this amusement park. Like, movies, where you play the movie, basically. And, uh, you get prize money out of each one of these movies. So the first one is The Home Run of Death. Jimmy, my son. Jimmy comes back to haunt us here, too. <laughs> so, Minnesota Hell Cinema. Let's see what this movie's about. Jimmy, my son. Story. <clears throat> you play a sport, a game, knowing full well that you're going to either win or lose. You never expect to die before your dreams come true. Neither did Jimmy, or his father, Gail Banballo, a Minnesota innkeeper. The text is kind of set up a secret baseball glitchy. arena in the basement of his inn, where he and his son practice day after day. Jimmy's hard work and batting skills finally led his team This to is the Jimmy spin-off, yeah. It started out a crisp spring day, but before Jimmy could go outside to play, he and his dad went downstairs to bat the ball around a few times. Upstairs, some teenagers had been playing with fire, turning the inn into a raging blaze. Whoa, the text. <laughs> the inn was a total loss, and so was Jimmy. No! In minutes, Mr. Banbala was so badly maimed, he turned into a hideous monster, oozing and bleeding, snarling and growling like a beast, enraged and bent on revenge. He tracked down the kids responsible for the fire and Even in this game, Jimmy starts out dead. <laughs> That wasn't enough for Bambalo. He won't leave his inn or his memories, so there he waits. In ambush. In ambush. The home run of death, okay. To the challengers. Your mission is to calm the anger of Ban Below. His only weakness is Jimmy. Though he is mad, he quickly drops his guard when he thinks of Jimmy. Memories of Jimmy is the key to the mission. Okay. Yo, thank you for the super chat, uh, Dojima. Hell yeah, thank you, thank you so much. Wait, there we go. Thank you, thank you. So, prize money is 50,000, and there's, like, clear conditions. If you, like, uh, what's the word? Satisfy all of them, you get the full 50,000. If you go, like, if you miss a few things, you get a bit less, but it's not that big of a deal. Anyway. We only have Erica right now, so. Uh-huh. Actually, wait, I just realized something. Duh. There we go. Okay. I just took four steps. So, the way this game works, basically, is you have to avoid traps. Uh, the, the meter up there, the huge freaking meter taking like a third of the screen is... Uh, it kind of detects what you're gonna find. So I think for sight, hearing, or smell, it's a trap. Sixth sense is either an encounter or an item, if I remember right. Yo, thank you, thank you, thank you. 
We making it out of Yokohama with this one, speaking silet, speaking silet, fire, 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 fire. Fire, fire, thank you, Dojima. Yo, Kirato, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. Fire, fire. So, I think almost every level has this item here. The horror monitor. If you miss this one in this level, you, you'll be kind of fucked. Because this is, this is what you use to um, detect traps and items. <clears throat> Sixth sense. Anything here? Oh, no. There's something really close. Ooh, Hassy! I'll take that. Uh, what game is this? Illbleed. It's a spooky horror game. Not really spooky, but you know. So you use adrenaline to um, detect the traps and items. And it's limited, so you have to be careful. And I think there's a trap there, so... Cool. <laughs> I avoided death. Cool. They got that opera voice going on. Okay, we have a, a hearing trap here somewhere. The phone? Cool. cool. There's an item too, I guess. Oh, newspaper clipping too. Fire at Chateau Bonbelo claims the life of owner and son. Fire broke out last night in the annex of Chateau Bonbelo. Jimmy, eight, son of Mr. Bonbelo, 41, died of severe burns. Improper use of fireworks by guests allegedly caused the fire. Okay. There's something else, I guess? Oh, another? Okay. Youngsters, come join us! Chateau Ben Below opens today. Youth Hostel. Chateau Ben... They really love that name. Chateau Ben Below opened today. A place where the young can gather. Owner, Mr. Ben Below, says with enthusiasm, I want the chateau to be an utopia for teenagers. The hostel, an excellent leisure facility surrounded by nature as an excellent leisure facility. Okay. <laughs> Is there an item somewhere around here? Hmm. Uh oh, smell. What smells? Oh. Cool. cool. Okay, where's the item? There's an item somewhere here. Oh, there we go. Salad! In an abandoned place. Let's go. There's something else here, somewhere. Sight. What could it be? Mm. Okay. Cool. cool. Ooh, okay. Yeah, how many times did, did they say Bumbalo and Jimmy in this game? <laughs> okay, I think the picture is a... I mean, look at it! If that's not a trap, I don't know what is. Cool. cool. So, if you haven't noticed already, spotting traps successfully gives you back adrenaline. So I can detect more stuff. Didn't check this, apparently. Okay, nothing here. Okay! Mm -hmm. Oh. Smell. What smells? Okay. Haunting ground? I'm not sure. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So, something, probably the most annoying thing about this game is the bleed mechanic you see above the health bar, the, the red one. If you run, 
it keeps increasing. If it reaches if it reaches max um, max amount, you basically die. So you have to either walk or stand still. Which uh, I'm gonna walk. Hmm. Damn. <laughs> it reminded me of a Courage, the Cowardly Dog, uh, scene. So I guess there's nothing here or there. Hmm, <laughs> Hell Knight. I haven't heard about that one, but I might check it out. Uh-oh. Uh... Okay, nice. We got that one. Return the slab! Or suffer my curse. That used to scare the shit out of me as a kid. <laughs> like, unbelievable levels. Uh-oh. Combat! <laughs> Here we go! Okay, so, you have two options. You can fight, or you can use the helipad to escape battles. And you can dodge, too. Okay. Don't ask me how this works, but it just does. It just works, as Todd says. I don't even have a weapon right now, so... No! Let me just... Boom. Narrow escape. Yeah, this is a Sega game, I think. Or at least it was on the... What's it called? Another thing? It was on the Dreamcast. That has to be it, right? Yes. Cool. Uh, which do you prefer? I prefer third person. Well, I don't mind fixed cameras either. Both are nice. There's something somewhere. Oh. Steak dinner, <laughs> just on the ground. Yo, thank you, Crypto, Cryptico, for the dragon tier. Thank you, thank you. Always a pleasure, buddy. Welcome. Oh. Ew. Who oh, farted? Nothing special. Calculator. There's something else, too. Oh, bandage. I'll take that. Oh, there's something here. Hearing. The alarm, I guess. The smell. There. Okay, we got something. Nice, 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 nice. Hassy. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, I gotta watch the health and the bleed too. Hold on, speaking of health. No wait, not this. Item list. Stamina, ingredients are kept secret. I'm thinking of eating... Hmm. Yeah, let's let's have the salad. Ooh, not bad. Is this a morgue or high school locker? Good question, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh shit. Uh oh. <laughs> He died! Okay, my heart rate is going off the charts. Gotta be careful. I just remembered that there's an- this is an issue with this game as well. Like, sometimes if there's a wall between you and the trap, and then he just comes straight out of the corner, it- like, it doesn't detect it that way. You know what I'm saying? Like, you have to have line of sight with the trap. 
<laughs> okay, sight. What could it be? I can't see anything else, so I guess... Oh. A giant hand. <laughs> Um, this is emulated. If you want to buy this game, oh god, you'll have to literally spend hundreds of dollars. So yeah, good luck with that. Okay. How high can the heart rate go? I think it's like 200 or 250. If you reach that, you, well, you faint. Okay, watch this. Home run bat. Jimmy, 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 it's time for practice. Get out to the training field now. Hey, you're not Jimmy. I am Jimmy. To how, um... I, I honestly don't even know what it is. Jimmy! Mm, there's an item somewhere. Jimmy! Ironheart. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of golden cutscenes in this game. And trust me, it gets better. But yeah, uh, someone was asking if the heart is my health. Three things are my health in this game. The heart, the health bar itself, and then the bleed meter. Again, if the bleed meter goes uh, to max, then... I think we can ignore this trap. I, I hope. If the uh, bleed meter goes to max, I die, basically. I don't think there's an item here anyway. Now I know why you wanted to play this game. Yeah, trust me, it gets better. <laughs> uh, okay, the blade is almost out. It's pretty annoying. It's the most annoying thing, probably. Okay. Uh, Jamie! Let me... There's something here. Okay. And steak dinner! Let's go! Now let me save. What is the game about? A horror-themed amusement park. Your friend got lost, or... Well, they vanished in it, so you have to find them. <clears throat> Yo, King. Uh, this is on an emulator. Now, that was perfectly safe food. What are you talking about? Don't you pick up food from the ground? You gotta give it a try sometime. Okay. Alone in the Dark. No, I haven't played it, but I watched the playthrough of it. And I know my dad played it way back in the day, too. Oh, shit. Run! <laughs> He's doing karate, bro. No way. Uh-oh. You can't instantly move out of the helicopter animation. I'll have him do an animation like that, and then... Actually, I did get a bat. Hold on. No, wait, wait, no! God damn it! What's the attack button, actually? Maybe I need to equip the... No. If you don't have a weapon, you can just use your fists. I'm just wondering what the hell the attack button is. Oh, oh, oh! There we go! But we're close to, uh, you know, this, so might as well take it. My guy is doing karate, goddamn. Okay, where did I come from? Mm -hmm. That is a lot of blood, yeah. <laughs> okay. There's an item somewhere, or an encounter. Oh, ampule, I'll take it. Yo, Mr. Fox, how you doing? 
Why do you bleed like 50 gallons? <laughs> yeah, don't worry about it. It's just uh, an ill bleed thing, if you will. Okay. Oh. Relaxation CD. Favorite Yakuza song? A lot of them. Holy shit, two of them? Bruh! Okay, let me try to distract them here. Uh oh, danger. Oh, they can attack each other, I forgot about that. Hey, hurry up! Okay, wait, 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 wait. Uh oh. Nice! Just barely. <clears throat> okay. I think it's usually better to escape an encounter rather than fight, actually. But I don't know. I think if you win, you get adrenaline. I could be wrong. An injection! Oh, hell yeah! And some random abandoned building? Seems legit. What is this game? The best game you'll ever see. <laughs> Yeah, I need to take something for my heart. Hold on. Relaxation CD. Let's take that. Relaxes pulse fully. Hmm. Recording of wave sounds, dolphins, and wind-blown trees. Swallow without chewing as it may explode. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Uh... Let's take the CD. Lo-fi CD, yeah. Explain the UI. You use the um, sights, or the um, senses up there, to detect traps or items, basically. Uh-oh, we have something. Uh-oh. <laughs> Blood! Okay, that's one thing we stopped. Steak dinner? Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> There's an encounter. Okay, did we fight this guy this time? Oh, he was just... That was actually a good opportunity to just go for the helicopter. He's pretty slow for now. Uh-oh, okay. Maybe that's gonna change. Hey, hurry up! Uh-oh. Yeah, let's just escape. <laughs> I do have a Steam Deck, yeah. It's really good for emulating games. Hmm. There's something somewhere here. The smell, is that? Okay, gotta be careful. Adrenaline is low. Okay, we stopped one. Cool. There's something somewhere here. Ooh, salad, okay. Why is there a helicopter? Don't ask, just accept it. <laughs> Uh oh. Damn, okay. Holy bleed, bruh, wait. Okay, gotta eat salad, and I also gotta take something to stop the bleeding. Let's have a steak dinner, and... There we go. Sight. Hmm. Okay, nice. Cool. Hassy. Let's go. Testimonial.
There's something else here. Mmm, sight. What could it be, though? There's a lot of things. There, maybe? No. Oh, this is another uh, note. How much blood does she have? All the supply in the world. Can you quickly run down how the game works? You have to detect traps using the uh, senses above. Uh, that's that's the very short gist of it. Um, yeah, thank you, character. I really appreciate it. Mass homicide at Chateau Bambolo. Owner, Mr. Bambolo, mysteriously disappeared. Mercilessly murdered bodies were found at Chateau Bambolo, burnt. All identified as young guests. Mr. Bambolo, the hotel owner, is missing. Details are still under investigation. Mr. Bambolo's diary was found at the site. Hatred directed toward the guests who caused the fire filled the pages. The state police are searching for their suspect, Mr. Ben Below. Ben Below. What? Bruh. Okay. I guess I'll get stabbed. Huh. <sighs> Bam below. <laughs> Gotta love it. Encounter? Or item? Oh, nice. Nice. I'll take it. My heartbeat is getting up. Nothing here. I guess not. I have to wonder how she can tank all those sharp objects. She was built for this. Uh oh. Sight, what could it be? Wait. What was the camera button again? Is it the TV by any chance? Wait. You guys have to see this if it is. No, it's not. Hmm. I need adrenaline. <laughs> No, I didn't play as this, uh, this uh, as a kid, actually. I remember some people recommending me play it years ago, but I never did. I watched the playthrough of it, and I was like, oh my god, why did I miss this game? Okay. <clears throat> Damn, that's a lot of adrenaline. Goosebump Horrorland, no. It's pretty close, apparently. Whoa. But I was aiming at the table. There was nothing. Okay, we got one. I'll take it. Injection! Another one. I'll take it. Hmm. Okay. Uh oh. Ew, okay, who who clogged the toilet? Be honest. <laughs> I think if you let this play out, you will actually just see, like, shit fly at you. Caution bump? Hell yeah. What's the difference between her and the other characters? Good question, actually. So, objectively, this girl is the best one to use, because um, every other character, if a monster, say, knocks you down, they have this, like, very long animation for them to get up. She doesn't. She's the only one, for some reason. Um, so, yeah, there's that. But they all have different stats, which I do like. But, yeah, objectively, this girl is the best one. Okay, I hope this is gonna be the TV scare. What? Whoa! <laughs> Spooky. That's actually the first time I see that one. Um, so I did hear about this, but the traps in this game are randomized, which is really cool for a game from its time. Sixth Sense.
Oh, is this here, maybe? Whoa. What? Oh, my heart beats. <laughs> oh, no. Thank you for waking me up, buddy. Okay. Um. Okay, gotta move a little bit. Buddy, over here. Oh, close! There we go. Cassie, I'll take it. Walmart liquor, yeah. <laughs> okay, I need to take something for the heartbeat. God. Relaxes pulse fully. We only have one. Stops bleeding. Hell yeah. Okay. Now we're set. <laughs> yeah, she's a beast. And she gets even better. Very tiny amount of bleeding, and we're set. Oh. Encounter? Sight. Deep breath. Okay. What the hell is that? Relaxes pulse by inhaling through nose and exhaling through mouth. That's an item. <laughs> Bruh, okay. <laughs> he died from cringe at the deep breath item. Okay. Anything here? I guess not. Oh, there's something. Passy. There's a lot of passies. Yo, Hootimus. <laughs> Sixth sense. Bambalo's diary. <clears throat> X month, X uh, day. Hotel business is on track. Had intensive bat batting exercise with Jimmy in the basement again. Batting style seems improved. Chin still goes up when he swings. Well... Practice again tomorrow. We'll try a thousand swings. Chin did not go up today. Good job, Jimmy. That's the swing. Minnesota Kids League Finals tomorrow. Eat protein-rich food tonight. You'll need a lot of energy. Papa will get up at four tomorrow to make a special drink for you. Do your best, Jimmy. We won the championship. Jimmy hit the winning homer. He is the MVP. Congratulations, Jimmy. I can't help shedding my tears of joy. I'll confirm all interests in the restaurant. Guests may ask Mr. Bambalo, who's that? Ah, oh, that's Jimmy's. He was chosen MVP in the boys' league. It's a thrill just to think about it. I shall treat the guests with barbecue tonight. Who do you think the home run king is this year? It's Jimmy. All because you endured my hard training. You have done well, Jimmy. Your trophy is magnificent. Let's place it in our bedroom so we can see it every day, Jimmy. Keep hitting and fill this chateau with your records and trophies. Let's go, Jimmy. Let's go. Jimmy. Deep breath again. <laughs> God, this game is something. Mm. Hassie. Jimmy's trophy. Jimmy! Diary. Bambalo's diary, too. Oh, Jimmy, you are now gone. <laughs> oh, Jimmy, you're now gone. Wait, 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 wait. Papa will treasure your bat to the one you practiced with and hit the winning comer with. Now I curse the hateful youngsters holding that bat. Bastards. Why did my beloved Jimmy have to be killed by such imbeciles? Papa will revenge your death. I'll kill all lurking around. I'll do it for you, Jimmy. He's finally got, gone off the... Uh, what did they say? The deep end? <laughs> gone too soon. Okay, where's this item?
There's something somewhere. Oh, oh shit. That's what it was. Oh, not these guys again. <laughs> the body slam. No! Fuck. You know what happened there? Oh god. It happened again. Bruh! So, this game has a weird system if you want to walk or run. If you start moving the stick slowly, you'll walk, even if you end up taking it to max, like, up, or any direction. If you instantly, like, do this to the max, then she will run, if that makes sense. Nice, 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 nice. Hey, hurry up! Hurry up! Wait, let me, let me have them do an animation or something. Hey, hurry up! <clears throat> Yo, Red Carp, how you doing? Let me just check the other room. <laughs> Damn, okay. Ooh, a bandage. I'll take it. Oh! Oh, okay. I guess that's it. <clears throat> oh! Nice! Another one. She jumps at every single thing, yeah. <laughs> Which is funny considering at the beginning she said, like, her father basically made her desens desensitized to everything scary. Deep breath. <laughs> Nothing special. Is that? Ooh, Hassie. Okay. Okay. What? Bruh! <laughs> Sheesh. Oh my god, my health. I need to heal. Uh, nice, Red Carp. Yeah, this is... <laughs> I'll have another one. We need something for the bleed, right? And we're set, I think. There's something somewhere here. Don't tell me it's an encounter. I think it is. Okay, luckily this guy is easy to escape. But, uh... Let's not get caught with our pants down, as they say. Uh-oh. shame that you have to avoid all the creative scares. Yeah, I know what you mean. There's a lot of really cool scares in this game, or, well, traps. Like, but, you know, if you... If I had to sit through every single one, I'm gonna die. Which is a shame, because there's a lot of really cool ones. Okay, there's something somewhere. Mm -hmm. Oh. Newspaper. Is this real? Human flesh cooked in the kitchen inside Chateau Bambolo? State troopers find traces of human flesh in kitchen. Did the missing Mr. Bambolo commit this atrocity? The hostel used to be an osis for young people, but now it's called the Bizarre Hotel by Scared Locale. Shit. <laughs> Bizarre Hotel. Does it sound cursed when I start speaking Arabic, guys? There's something somewhere. Oh. Nice. Nitro, whatever it was. Uh oh. Sixth sense. Encounter? 
or item. Whoa! Okay, hold on. What does that do? TOS? A roll magazine. Adult magazine. Slightly increased pulse. So, fun fact about this item. Um, all it does, again, like it says, it just increases your heartbeat. And if your heartbeat gets high enough, you die. So, porn kills you, I guess, or something like that. <laughs> I, I think there's literally no use to it. It just... That, that's the only thing it does. And I don't think having a higher heartbeat does anything for you. Like, at all. Relaxation CD? Now that I can get behind. <laughs> Nothing here? Oh! There is something here. Hell yeah. An encounter, maybe? Yes. Uh-oh, not this guy. That's a huge wrench. Okay, do we... You know what? Let's try to beat him this time. By the way, want to know something very sus about the game design in this game? The dodging kills you. So you can't rely on it too often. Uh-oh. Yeah, I think it's better to just run, honestly. You might be wondering, yeah, how the hell does dodging kill you? You see, it increases your heartbeat, and if it gets high enough, you, uh, d well, faint. At first, and then eventually you die. Fights give a lot of adrenaline, though, so that's good, I guess. Okay, so let me drink some Hansi and then mm, let's take this. Oh, that's not much actually. Mm, there we go. There's something somewhere. <clears throat> Ooh, I'll take that. Yeah, her heart rate is 176 BPM, and she still says cool. Ew, there we go. <laughs> Disgusting. Covered in shit now. Um, I need something for the bleeding. Mm-hmm. There we go. There's something else somewhere. Bleeding is almost out. There we go, now we can run. Oh! Ar wait, was that? Oh, it's not here. Wait, where the hell is it then? Huh. Oh! Artificial brain. <laughs> okay. Right, so I think you're gonna use these for character upgrades. So that's cool. Bio body. <laughs> oh, there's something. Discount ticket? What? I think this is my first time seeing this. Encounter? Yep. My adrenaline is really good, so I'm just gonna escape. Bro, run! Uh-oh. He's so fucking fast. <laughs> run! Oh, I'm actually surprised I dodged that. 
Oh! Oh my god. This guy is zooming. Oh! How, how did that miss? I mean, hey, I'm not complaining, but... Oh, there's something else, apparently. Oh, nice. Nice! I got two in one. Kinda. What possessed you to play Illbleed? I saw this game multiple times being played by people, and I was like, you know what? I gotta stream this. Chat has to see this game. It's just so unique. Okay, I'm gonna walk because... Actually, no, let me use the... Uh, a bandage. <laughs> there we go. Uh, this came out in 2001. Okay, we have a save point. Nice. I might actually take a... deep breath. There we go. 2001, yeah, I think. Um... I have no idea. Would you rather take complete silence or three piano notes playing a looping all the time? Hmm, probably complete silence, I don't know. So, wait. Oh, we can upgrade ourselves already. Recovery and build up. Okay. Oh shit, I don't have money. Okay. Yeah, probably gonna wait for until after I beat the stage for that. This is cool. Dummy man's photo box. That's Dummy Man. What's the story behind the gameplay? How it came to be, I have no idea. I think the person behind this game, like, the writer, I think, or something like that, unfortunately passed away not long after the game came out, so... We can't have... My boy, Jimmy. Only Jimmy. St stadium. Stadium. S star. Giants. Jimmy. Jimmy Love. Home run, Jimmy. Holy shit. Someone loves <laughs> Jimmy. <laughs> hmm. Strange way to space the display trophies. We got a trophy earlier. Actually, no, wait. Maybe there's stuff around here. Let me check first. Is this an encounter? Diary. Bambalo. Give me back my Jimmy. Give me back my Jimmy. Give me back my Jimmy. Bastards. Give me back my Jimmy. Give me back my Jimmy. Give me back my Jimmy. Bastards. My Jimmy. That's... There's a nice beat to that. So wait. We put... We got two things. Give me back my Jimmy. Give me back my Jimmy. Give me back my Jimmy. Oh, yeah. Give me back my Jimmy. Okay. Is that... Which one of these is Jimmy? <laughs> they all look different. Give me back my Jimmy. Oh, yeah. Give me back my Jimmy. Give me back my Jimmy. Give me back... Jimmy's trophy. Memorable item of Bambalo. Awarded when he became home run king in the kids' league. Did I miss something else? Oh. Number three, first base, Jimmy. Jimmy. Okay, go. Here we go. Oh. Oh, damn, Erico, good job. <laughs>
Is that Van Below? Jamie? <laughs> oh no. Okay. So I think, yeah, you can't kill him. You have to escape. Hey, hurry up! <laughs> Jimmy! Oh god. No! Okay, so it's hard to get him to do an animation and then escape, because as soon as he does it, we get hurt. Okay, there we go. <sighs> what game is this? Uh, it's in the title, It'll Bleed. You have to save your friends in an amusement park. Jimmy. New music. Oh! Oh shit! Hold on. Let me check the map. Okay, so... To the left... Okay, so left here... And then, what is the rope ladder in terms of lore? If I guess if an attraction gets too dangerous for you, you can like ask the staff for help. Like, there, there's so many weird things about this game, but uh, I'm here for it. Don't, don't, don't. Oh shit. I think we should almost be out of there. So we follow the path and then... It's Kevin! That's not Jimmy! No, sadly, I'm not going in blind. I, I saw, like, multiple playthroughs of this game. But... Jimmy! I think a lot of chat will enjoy this still, so... <laughs> okay, there's an item somewhere. A <laughs> speed ladder in a toilet. Okay. G guess I'll take it. Okay, um, wait, no, I'm, I sped the game up by mistake. Um, okay, we take the right, and then... Uh, holy maze, look at that. <laughs> uh, we got this, though. Yeah, what do we think of this music? Don't, don't, don't. And now... Straight ahead. We're on the right track. Don't, don't, don't. Don't, 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 don't. But I thought that was crashing. <laughs> okay, so first turn and then. Uh, okay. Now I heard about Signalis though. Uh oh. Oh, what? Uh oh. Did he spit on me? Hey, hurry up! I'm almost dead. Let me take him here. Nice. These are fast compared to the first fight with him. Okay, uh... Gotta heal. Let me have a steak dinner. And now we're set. Um, okay. No, wait, not that. So now we go backwards and then... Shouldn't be too complicated. But just to make sure, there's an encounter nearby. 
Hold on. Okay, doesn't really matter which way we go. We're close. Thank you, Streamlabs. Thank you, thank you. Always a pleasure, buddy. I need to add more, like, timed commands with the Streamlabs. Like, uh, once talking about the merch and then <laughs> gamer subs. And then, um... Another one that says, I love this chat. How about that? Kevin! Kevin? A ghastly has been detected. Warning. Uh oh. Intending explosion likely with the rise of room temperature. Okay, uh... No! There we go, that's what I meant to do. No! Oh god. Uh oh. Okay, okay, doing good so far. All right, not bad. Uh oh. No. Okay, almost there. Nice. We got him. We got him. Bump below a boss fight. <laughs> uh. Okay. Uh. Kevin. Kevin. Kevin, are you all right? Oh, uh, what the, Erico. Oh, this is the worst place to be right now. Let's get out of here. Woohoo, yeah! You're our savior. I'll help you any way I can, you hear me? You hear me? <laughs> You're crazy. You're crazy. I love the voice acting, dude. And we got Kevin, another playable character. Okay. I'll help you any way I can, you hear me? Okay. Amazon! <laughs> Wait, that's something else? Protector? What the hell? I'll help you any way I can, you hear me? Damage to stamina and bleeding will be reduced by two thirds. Holy shit! Let's go! <laughs> Oh, I need to... Let me take care of the bleeding, actually. So, from what I heard by someone that plays this game, like, played this game a lot, every time you finish a stage, your items disappear. So, you might as well go ahead and use stuff. Um, I'll use that. I think we're good. Yep, should be. Bowling. That's a massive bum below. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, so this is one of the worst parts about the game. You'll see why. Thankfully, the dodge gives you insane iframes. Uh-oh. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my- The reach is insane. 
<laughs> I really want to make a save state, but also, I don't know. <laughs> I think we should be almost there. Gotta time the dodge. Boom. Okay. Pay attention to this cutscene. It's so fucking good. Control room. Can you hear me? This is Control Operator Jackson. I repeat, this is Control Operator Jackson in the control room. Our oil pressure is normal here. Average electric current is 52,000 volts. Generating capacity of 2,700,000 watts. 10-4, main control room here. <laughs> Checking the database now. Hold on a second. The pressure on the leg is a bit too high. I bet it's the right leg. Last time I checked, it was a bit rusty. That's all right. It's still within control parameters. And what are you planning to do for dinner tonight? I'm starving. I think I'll have fish or something. Fish or something. Course, meat doesn't sound too appetizing. <laughs> yeah, we've got enough meat laying around over here to feed an army of rats. Help! <laughs> Stop right there. This area is restricted to authorized personnel only. Please, I can't buy that horse. Authorized personnel all? only. No, isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? Five million dollars to build this Five enormous million. thing we call Banbal. <laughs> Banbal. Skeletons controlled with advanced hydraulics with custom bearings and joints. You're looking at two meters of thick titanium for every bone. All computer controlled by me. <laughs> How'd you like that big sucker, eh? <laughs> Who the fuck thought of this? <laughs> hmm, what are they trying to tell me here? Hmm. Of course, what else would you do here? <laughs> He's a robot too! <laughs> oh my god, this game, dude. <laughs> okay, uh... ID card, let's go. Is this a murder? I don't know. What does Chad think? Oh my god. That voice acting, though, legendary. Whoa, whoa, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Salad. Oh my god, my bleeding is off the charts. I don't think I have anything for bleeding either. Uh, no, wait, I do. Stops bleeding. There we go. Amazon. This total recovery drug was made thanks to Michael's favor to extend our lives for five minutes. What? Huh. <laughs> and there he is. Yeah, so Erica is going to get away with murder, I guess. I, I Well, deba debatable on whether or not that was a murder, but... <laughs> Cutscenes like that is, uh, why I love this game so much. <laughs> so basically everything... Yeah, so, like, you know, you see people bleeding gallons, you see, like, monsters and shit. But, but it's all supposed to be part of the attraction, I guess. I don't fucking know, it's so weird. <laughs> and I love it for that. Shouldn't you break the control center? I think it's fine. No one is controlling that anymore. That was a rubber baseball bat, yeah, he's okay. Just don't mind the falling head. <clears throat> this is quite a hike. Goal! And there we go. This 
President Obama in this game? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, I guess we use the ID card here. I think you need to stand in a very specific spot, from what I heard. Hold on. From what I heard, this spot is actually a speedrun killer because, uh, because of how specific the spot is. It's one of those games, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> okay, let me try here, I guess. Nope. Wait, there was a card reader on the previous gate. Oh, completely missed that. Thank you. Thank you, George. Someone is paying attention. Thank you. <clears throat> Why is the card reader here? <laughs> That's the question. There we go. I don't mind backseating, like, uh, especially in situations like this, you can just say. If you're like, oh, Leon, why are you not doing this? Oh my god, you fucking suck. Like, cringe, imagine playing like this. Then yeah, like, please shut up. Otherwise, I really don't mind. Holy shit, we lost a lot of money. We got hit a lot, we took a bit more time than needed, and I guess we didn't get enough traps. I mean, hey, I'll take it. God, the music. It feels so good coming back to this after each stage. Yo, thank you for another super chat, Dojima. Thank you, thank you. God, I love this song. <laughs> So, you have a shop here. Blood, Bloody Mary's Drugstore. Safety and health. Sale. Variety drugs. Low price. Yo, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Super diet. Active. Heartbreak. Okay, no joke. We have a drink, um, in a lot of cafeterias in my country called Heartbreak. It's like a mix of different things, like... Strawberry, probably, something like that. And sometimes they put ice cream in it. It's- it's not bad. Super guard. Water. <laughs> Can you explain this game? You have to go to this horror-themed amusement park to save your friends. Uh, you go through different movies that are the stages. So, what do we have? Active, Super Diet, again. This is, like, you know... <laughs> and then we have all of this. <laughs> Surprisingly detailed for the Dreamcast. I know I'm using an emulator, but still. I mean, look at this. Max Power. Active. Hassy. Anyway. So you can buy items for the next stage. Uh, they will help. Uh, I want to use some money for upgrades, but... So... I'll get this. A couple of those. Uh, salad. Steak dinner. Maybe more blade items. 
And one more of this. Another heal, another Hassie. Oh yeah, adrenaline. Oh shit. Uh, okay, that's it. I will spend the rest on upgrades. Da, 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 da. <laughs> no, 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 no. Have you seen the game Rent the Hero? No, I haven't. But I know of Blue Stinger. I know it's another cult classic. Return to life. Wait. Oh, damn it. So if anyone dies, you revive them here. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna get upgrades for the bleed, I think. Or maybe the adrenaline, too. Oh god, that's expensive, actually. Not enough money. Oh no. Yeah, I'm gonna get a bleed upgrade. It's like the most annoying thing. You get a cutscene! Yeah, the soundtrack is really good, actually. Especially the park one. And there we go. We're a changed person now. Jimmy, where are you at? I miss you! And there's the second movie! I think this was blocked off at first, right? Plans for more horror games this month? Oh, definitely. I already have something in mind for tomorrow, and after tomorrow, and probably for a while. A lot of people have suggested stuff in my Discord, so... So, what do we have now? The Revenge of Queen Worm. Let me take a closer look, wait. I never forget you, Rachel. Starring David Rodriguez with Rachel, Devil Monkey, Michelle Waters? That sounds familiar, doesn't it? That's actually Erica's friend, the uh, green-haired one, I think. Michael Reynolds film. <laughs> yeah, so, uh... Actually, hold on. While you guys are listening to this absolute banger, I'm gonna take a small break. Should I make coffee? I'll make coffee. I'll be back.
you guys see a cat walking in? Because uh, Charge actually walked in, and when I, when I approached the room, he kind of pretended he could not get in. I was approaching the room, and almost as if he knew he shouldn't, like, be there, he just kind of walked out. Anyway! Let's see what the Queen of Worm story thing is about. <clears throat> My chocolate ice cream tastes like Black Coca-Cola. Am I having a stroke? <laughs> Wish I could say. Wait, did I save? Let me go save. Yo, thank you for the 14 months, Isaac. Thank you. Cat stream. Hell yeah. Uh, how about it, fellas? A stream where it's just me and my two cats. Or should I say our cats? My dad brought one of them in, and the other one was brought in by... Well, not actually brought in, even. Um, some of my family just kind of shoved the cat onto my brother. I've always had two cats, actually. I just rarely mention the other one, because he doesn't like attention or the light. The Revenge of the Queen Worm. Okay. <clears throat> This one has no subtitles. Site has been turned into a morbid morgue, covered in blood, and the remains of numerous unidentified bodies. It's hard to believe that such a brutal massacre could have happened in this day and age, especially at such a secure location. It only took the rescue crew 20 minutes to respond to the emergency call, but by the time they arrived, it was too late. There were no survivors, and consequently no witnesses. So the mystery remains. Who or what could have done this? Who or it what? It seems too massive <laughs> and malicious for a single human to have done it. Or several for that matter. There were dark forces Damn, the David. Here, and no one's talking about it. it well, what's that you have, Leon? days ago, and the place has been dead quiet ever since. Do you guys have this brand, by the way? Luzine. Two challenges. It is too dangerous to enter alone. The camping site is closed now, but you cannot go back. We hope for a miracle for you to handle the incident and return safe and sound. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, 80,000 under half an hour. So, something about this level. You know how the previous level we had to like watch our steps literally and like scan traps? This level has no traps at all. So we can just kind of run around and wander freely. So I'm not gonna pick this guy, because like I said, this girl is actually, actually objectively, the best character in the game. Uh -huh. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Okay. Welcome to Camp David. I think there's something around here. Oh, there we go. 
news clipping one. Uncontrollable drop in worm prices. It hit another record low today. Worms drew attention as a protein-rich alternate to meat. Any worm fans? Prices remained low at sixteen dollars a kil kilo. When the price, the oh right, right, <laughs> okay, my brain kind of <clears throat> goofed a little bit. When the price declined to two dollars today, the market was at its lowest. Some economists point out the similarity with the tulip bubble in Holland in the 1630s. Investors and farmers are left with serious loses. <clears throat> yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just a Middle Eastern brand. Makes sense you guys don't have it. David Rodriguez, 68, became the king of worms by producing 10 times more worms than the average with the help of his queen worm, I am just speechless. It is extremely hard to keep worms. I no longer can afford to feed Rachel. Tell me if you have a better idea other than committing suicide. Prices are expected to decline further. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh. I'll take it. Horror monitor. Uh oh. Monkey! No! My horror monitor! Give it back! Give it back! <laughs> Mon killer stole the horror monitor. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> So there's going to be a lot of walking around in this level, as you can see. Like, some levels are stretched, just to be stretched. Monkey! <laughs> Monkey? What are you doing? <laughs> this is chat when they hear about new hostesses. Or Yakuza fans are not chat. Maybe some are chat. By the way, if you bring Kevin, he's also going to be naked here. So, uh, that's a cool detail. <laughs> like, same cutscene, just with Kevin. Okay. Wait, oh, that's the wrong button. I keep pressing that one. So that's... Oh, they both kind of lead the same way, but there's an item there. <laughs> Whoa! I'm gonna try to run away as usual. Bro, I couldn't even recover to run from that. Hey, hurry up! Hurry up! I probably had the chance to escape, actually, but... There we go. Narrow escape. Okay, so we have posters in this level. Scorpion. Wait, onion soup. Yeah, onion soup. And then Hassie. Recover. <laughs> what does that say? Kimgo? Beverage? I guess so, yeah. But uh, there's a lot of... Like... Just different poster. Why does I say that? Fucking onion soup twice in a row, and a third time here. Yeah, but we'll see later. A bunch of different ones. <clears throat> Metal pipe. I'll take it. Uh oh. <clears throat> Can you tell me how to get to the station? Man, I can never get over the dub. It's so weird. Excuse me! Can you tell me how to get to the station? What nonsense are you speaking? Uh-oh. <clears throat> okay, run! Oh my god. I'm locked into it like I can't. Okay, let me lure it somewhere else. Hey, 
Nice, just barely. <clears throat> okay. By the way, let this sink in. There's pretty much just a month until Gaiden. Oh. Monkey Bark. <laughs> Why does this remind me of, what's it called? Coco Pops? That cereal? Steak dinner from the trash. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. So I think now we go to the left. There should be an item there. Yep. <clears throat> Mummy popcorn. Delicious. Somewhere. Oh. Artificial plasma. Okay, so now we go to that big area. <laughs> uh oh. Monkeys! Okay, let me lure them here. <laughs> the jump. Nice. Man, I wish uh, you could instantly get out of the helicopter animation. Hey, hurry up! <laughs> Apparently, the weapon you get for the stage, the one we got earlier, the iron pipe, really sucks compared to the other melee weapons. Oh no. <clears throat> okay. I'm just gonna commit. Nice. Gang Beasts. I don't know that game. What is it about? <laughs> the YouTube monkey. Okay. Oh, the there's worms. Shit. So let me check. Mm, oh, that is a big place. Oh, okay. Monkey Park. Hey, hurry up! Speed Ladder. Oh, wait! I just remembered, I didn't use that at all last match. Or last level. I'm assuming that's like an instant escape or something? Uh, makes the helicopter ladder fall two times faster. Okay, yeah. Or wait, no, 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 no. That's a permanent effect. Nice. Uh-oh. Alright. Cinema theater. I want to stop, but the worm is behind us. Uh-oh. I need to check the map. I think, yeah, there's an item here, and then we can go the other way. Bandage. Okay. I just noticed my bleed meter. Holy shit. Uh, let's fix that. Or wait, we could... We could kind of tough it out right now, and then when it gets close to max, we use this. Yeah, let's go with that. Okay, dodged. <clears throat> okay, this is another big... Uh-oh. Okay, thankfully the worms are not too bad to dodge. Hey, oh, that was quick with that uh, speed ladder. Nice. Okay. We have an item there, and then... Man, this is a big level. It's always in the trash, too. Diary. Dave's diary. Okay. 
I started my worm business 10 months ago. With my success, I am known as the king of worms. If the prices continue to grow, I will buy a large house for us. Till then, I will keep raising worms and sell, sell, sell. A rep from Toronto, an outdoor facility supplier, wanted to buy my land today. He said they wanted to build a trendy camping site. I said no to the rep. I am not going to give up this this farm for any price, no matter how much they offer. I will never give up my worm farm. Worm prices dropped to a record low. This must be a bad dream. I got 2,000 new baby worms today and more are coming. The worm farm is running out of room and I am running out of money to feed the worms. What will I do if the prices keep falling? I signed the contract with Toronto today. I had no choice. The warm market is no good. At least the terms I negotiated were good for Rachel and I. I will keep the farm, but they will cut some of the forest around it. They also let me join the management of the campsite. I was a talented businessman and my talent will be used well. Watch me, Rachel, as I set out for a fresh start. <laughs> All right, David. Uh, Dave, not David. Close enough, I guess. Um, okay, we have one encounter there. There's something there. Oh, save point, okay. I'll take that. <clears throat> All right. Okay, I want to make sure I don't miss that item. Okay, so we can just take that turn and then continue on that um, road. Another diary of Dave. Yo, Mok, it's, it's an experience, to say the least. Rachel, how long has it been since we lived like father and daughter? Luck has been on my side since the beginning. You are my lady, Luck. But now, Duranto has cheated me. They l never let me join the business. Instead, I work at that 24-hour store as a living employee. The contract was a big lie. The farm was cemented immediately. The forest was cut down, and the wild monkeys died. Tell me, Rachel, how could this have happened? Rachel, you look well as always, but I'm worn out these days, running the store for 24 hours. By myself is tough. My health is decreasing daily. My heart is... I I'm alright. Or not. I, I can't breathe. I need help. I think I am dying. I no longer wish to live. I can hardly breathe. I am dying. I don't want to leave you alone, Rachel. I can't hold on anymore. Goodbye, my Rachel. Now that is a sad story if I've ever seen one. Uh... Man, this level is huge. <laughs> God damn. Okay, so... There's basically nothing on that path. Well, there is an extra road, but... Ooh. So wait, we want to go... Man, there's a lot of... I'm actually tempted to use the fast forward button. So I think there should be an item here. And I hear the worms behind me. Uh-oh. Anti-shock brace? Bro, I don't think I ever saw this. What the hell? Wait. Like, I saw multiple playthroughs of this. Avoid falling to a prone position. Oh. Oh, this is, um... So, you know what I said earlier about the other characters? Every time they get into an encounter, they fall on their asses. And, like, they take 5 to 10 seconds to get up. Erica doesn't do that, by default. Every other playable character does that. So, this makes them more like Erica. Uh... Okay, there is a couple items there. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know why, but every other character has this nerf for some reason. And I don't think you can get around it with upgrades. You need this item, most likely. Mm 
Nice, I'll take that. Artificial brain, I'll take it. Amazon, gimme. Yo, stay fresh, how you doing buddy? Hell yeah, I am ready. Okay, now we go back all the way. <laughs> Whoa, holy shit. <laughs> I wanted to kind of fast forward, but that's a little too fast. Okay, we have to go. Oh my god, look at look at the road. We have to go all the way there. <laughs> and then... Yeah. But uh, there's encounters on the way, so we can't... Or maybe we can. Wait. Uh, this is an emulator. So we... Yeah, we keep going straight from here, and it's a long run. What?! <laughs> Bruh! Dead? My ass. <laughs> okay, uh... I'm gonna restart the game. Wait, wait, this is... <clears throat> this is not it, Chief. Wait. <laughs> oh, controller. Holy shit. <laughs> Okay, so let me... There we go. The fact that that was the scariest thing to happen is, uh... Insane. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, shit. Wrong... Uh, oh, my God. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I think I know what happened, actually. It wasn't, like, the encounter or anything like that. I was at high blade, so making the game faster, you know, made the thing go up quicker, and I died because of that. Wow. <laughs> so, you can see it here. Look at the bleed meter, the red one flashing. If that goes to max, you die. So you basically have more than one health bar, if that makes sense. Now wait, let me check. Okay, we need to uh, get those stuff again. This is just a diary, we don't need to read it again. Just to make sure I don't go the wrong way. Okay, we have that corner, and then those two items there. What? Oh. I was like, oh no, did I do it again? Yeah, this is the deleted Haruka chapter. Welcome. Okay, so... So this is basically useless to uh, Eriko, actually. I just noticed I should take care of the heartbeat as well. <laughs> so, one... Two... And three. I think an Amazon fully heals everything, so I might actually take that. Because we do need, like, literally everything right now. Uh... Ho 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 ho, look at that! Beautiful! There we go. All good, baby. Okay, so... Now we're back to where we were, basically. Uh oh. <clears throat> so yeah, Amazon or Jeff Bezos, thank you, I guess. <laughs> you saved our lives. Oh, god damn it. Oh no. Bro, I just used an Amazon, god damn it. Leave me alone. Okay, we should be good now. Hey, hurry up! Boom. This is like the one level where that helicopter um, rescue makes sense. Okay. 
Actually, let me walk until the bleeding goes away. Hey, hurry up! There we go. Okay, this is a long road. Attention to the back. More like attention to this. Monkeys! Oh boy. Hopefully the fast ladder is gonna help here. Run! No, god damn it. Okay, commit! Nice. What's the lore reason for her to just not stay on the helicopter? She has to finish the level by herself, I guess. So these are basically like amusement park attractions. You go through them. And it's uh, it's an experience. Nice, spicy. I never played Corpse Party. How many games are there for that even? I always get confused by it. Okay. Okay, let me walk for a bit until the bleeding goes away. There we go. Leg gas. Legateru. Food, gas. But most importantly, leg gas. Not November. Who even cares about that? Key ha has been inserted, but it doesn't move due to lack of gas. <clears throat> you should get an actual. Oh man, not another drunk worker. I can't even stand looking at you. Get out of here. Don't ever come back. You hear me? Bro, I'm just passing through. You hear me? <laughs> David, you piece of crap. Uh, you always made fun of us, Drant employees. He did not just call him that. That Rachel. She was always your favorite. He did not just call him that. Oh, what? Oh, shit. Infinite health? Holy, that's a big worm. Oof, okay. So, if you go to the mud here, you fall down to that boss. I wanted to jump, but it didn't go so well. Fellas? What is this? House of the Lightning. Hmm. Hmm. Dummy man. <laughs> it is your turn to be dummy. <laughs> Who makes this? Bruh. Baby bottle. Hmm. Someone seems to be inside. Clash heat. Died. 35 stun. What? What's that word after st stuntmans? Okay, <laughs> stuntmans, sick. Clash, four thousand five hundred two, twenty. I can't fucking count. <laughs> Cars, twenty-five million. What waste? What? So, there's gonna be a fight here, and it's, it's a pretty annoying one, but let's do it.
Monkey! Oh my god, this weapon sucks. Uh, bro, I can't do shit! <laughs> it has a long wind-up. Yep. Run, Eriko! <laughs> no, don't walk. Run! Eriko. Dodge! Or something. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, someone died. Friendly fire? By the way, according to um, one person I watch, or well, I watched play this game, like he knows his stuff about this game, and he said this is one of the most annoying or difficult fights Thank in the game. You. If you hadn't shown up, God knows what that slimy monkey would have done to me. So you were the one who was calling for help. You received my telepathic message. Oh, that's so cool. From now on, I am with Erico. I feel very strong. I feel very strong. Let's go. That's another friend rescued. Michelle Waters. <laughs> Not punchy, actually, but I, I did watch a few punchy stuff. I'm talking about uh, used pizza. He loves he loves this game as well. <laughs> so I watched the Bok Basu play this, and I watched used used the pizza. Uh, pizza. Two different playthroughs for used pizza, by the way. He tries to make it a tradition to play this game every Halloween. Uh, I need to take care of the bleeding and stuff. Puppet combo games, maybe. Though, those are the exact kind of streams where I can imagine, like, 20 people only tuning in because, you know, jump scares. Ah! And stuff. But it's not... Uh, it's not out of the question. So... The bandages aren't that bad, actually. Uh, should we use... Uh, no, no, let's wait for the thing to get higher. Yeah, I did get the Sonic guy, Kevin. I'll help you in any way I can, you hear me? <laughs> I love that line. <laughs> okay, so... I think I'm supposed to go there. Locked. Maybe if I present the baby bottle? Oh, do you want it? Yes! Wait, that's... I was looking for that. It's... My dear Rachel's nursing bottle. Oh, how I miss those days. I'd nurse her with this bottle and she'd look up at me. Oh, I guess you're not from the Drott Corporation. Please, come inside. I have something to tell you. Okay, we're going in. So there's a lot of stuff in here for you to take. Fellas, who is this? Oh, wait. There we go. Who is that? Thanks for coming. <laughs> I'm sorry I yelled at you. Ever since the Drawn Corporation cheated me... Smile the pain away, guy. ...trusting anyone. I apologize. By the way, I want to ask you a favor. You seem decent and trustworthy. It's about my beloved Rachel. I wrote the details in my will. It's all right here. Please... Read it, will ya? Please? <laughs> please? Please, chat, will you feed it? Dave's note. I'll hang myself from the water tower tonight. If you read this, I will be around the first block of hell. I have good memories of the worm business. There is just one thing on my mind. Rachel, without me, what will happen to her? She will she will surely suffer from hunger. So I would like I would like to ask you a favor. K 
kill Rachel so I can be together with Rachel in the next world again. This is the best thing for us. Now kill her exactly the way I tell you. Burn her with a flamethrower. <laughs> no other way, okay? This may sound cruel, but you'll see why soon. I really need you to do this favor. I'm asking you. I am begging you. About the flamethrower, I keep this one I was using for weeding in a secret place. I don't want Duranto to find it. I'm taking the memo that shows the secret place with me. Find it on my body. Well, I'll go ahead and wait for Rachel around the second corner of hell. David Rodriguez. <laughs> Rusty key. Hassy. Hassy. Nitro something. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. I'll take it. Anything else? I think that's it. Come on. All this shop and that's it? I think that's really it. Okay, time to get Rachel. Who deals with weeds using a flamethrower? This guy. Okay, let me use... Uh, the survival horror? Yes, kinda. Take cash. Oh, I would if I could. Mutant worms, it came from the underground, coming to you. The posters here are so cool. Tom, wait, Tommy Hopper film, Massacre in Nature. Nominated in the National Award 12 section. Man, I'm here, alone. <laughs> what? Wait, is that man or ma'am? Looks like ma'am. Did someone mistype? <laughs> Literally the man meme. You know, the horse on the beach. Goblin Moon. I can't even read that name. Huh, okay. Uh oh! It's uh. Holy shit! <laughs> Ladies with guns! Nice. What? Oh, friendly fire. <laughs> nice. 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 Very nice. Dummy man. Bolts supporting the signboard are loose. Wait. Do I have an item for this or do I... Those are indeed women, yes. Hmm. Maybe I do need an item for this. So yeah, you're supposed to drop the sign so you can traverse in another place. Dummy man. Dummy man. Dummy man. Knock down, dummy man. Dummy man. <laughs> Mysterious catastrophe at campsite. All visitors killed. Site expected to close. Bodies of campgoers and destroyed cars found at Camp David in Arizona. Cause of the incident is still unknown. Local authorities rule out human intervention due to the scale of the incident. Slow progress by investigators caused by lack of evidence. Camp David was once a worm farm owned by David Rodriguez. Duranto acquired the land and built Camp David. Camp David opened on the 20th of last month, featuring wild monkeys and a drive-in theater. Okay. Actually, wait. Oh, an encounter, I guess? Has to be. Uh, whoa, there's a lot of items around here. So 
so there's something around here. Oh, Dave's memo, there we go. I buried it in the ground in front of the movie billboard. You can see the sign through the work hut window. Okay. I meant to jump, not open the thing. Um, so this is a game where you... Uh, you, you have to save your friends in this horror-themed amusement park. And you encounter a lot of interesting stuff on the way. So wait, I guess nothing's outside. Bio body. Wrench. Dave's diary. <clears throat> I bought a worm from a vendor so I could raise worms for sale. The vendor brought me his last worm. The worm was you, Rachel. So Rachel was a worm all this time. You are more special than any of the other worms I knew. Rachel is the name I wanted to give my daughter. Now go and have lots of babies. Help me make some money. <laughs> Something terrible happened to Rachel today. It was my fault, but I still don't know what happened. I was playing with her under the tree as usual. Then somehow she slipped my from my hands and fell into a gas tank. I picked her up right away. I thought she would die after being soaked in so much gas. I was terrified. Strangely, she started sucking the gas of her, off of her body. She never did weaken. How bizarre that my little girl did such a thing. All I can do now is look after her. It seems Rachel is growing too fast since the gasoline accident. Now, all I can do is feed her as m much gasoline as she desires. She gets bigger and bigger each day, and she doesn't look like a worm anymore. It is okay to get big, but her size is beginning to scare me. She's in good shape, though. I'm getting worried about her. She outgrew me in 10 days. Her reproduction rate is 10 times higher than any other worm. Her babies are of high quality, and they will sell well. Well, I didn't get... I did get my wish of wealth and happiness. Bring on more worms, Rachel. <laughs> yeah, what do we think of the lore? Rachel? Please burn Rachel, please. That giant worm is Rachel? <laughs> Okay, there is pictures of her. Oh god, I'm bleeding a lot. Hold on. Uh... Mm. A hassy, another one. And we're good. I think. Would you still be making streams if you were a worm? Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh shit, I missed something. A streamer can get by any problem. Flamethrower, there we go. I think we just need the gas now, and I don't know if I missed it. Would you save chat, Leon, if you if we were stuck in the amusement park? Oh, you know it, buddy. You know it. What kind of streamer would I be if I didn't do that? Leon, would you still love us if we were all worms? Of course. Who do you think you're talking to? So now we can bring this down. Oh yeah, I guess we get the gas from there. There we go. Unscrewed bolts from the signboard. It is your turn to be dummy. <laughs> Wait, is that a new sign? I didn't see it before, wait. Eyes... What? Eyes... What? Eyes wide? Open? Oh, eyes wide open, okay. These, uh, sure are... Eyes. Worm 
Leon 7, hell yeah. I want to find a save point, but I don't think there's any. Hold on. I hope this doesn't, like, break anything, but... Okay. How the hell did he get this game? It's flipping rare and expensive on Dreamcast. Uh, this is what uh, YouTube comments call the YouTube money, if you will. I make thousands a month, didn't, didn't you know? Hmm. Oh, did we need to unscrew another one? I think we did. Uh-oh. This is a problem. Yeah, I think we need- to oh god, we need to go back. What's up with the heartbeat? Um, every time you get scared, it goes up. If it goes high enough, you faint. And if it goes even higher, you die. Yeah, millions a month. I make millions a month. Millions. Okay, so I need to find that billboard, I guess. Uh, which one was it? It wasn't this one, was it? No, wait. Oh. Right, let me follow that. This one? Yeah, I'm an oil tycoon. I live in the Middle East, I obviously have to be, right? Okay, I think that's all we have to do. Influ Leon 7. <laughs> Right, we should be able to safely cross. Man, speaking of buying, like, old games... I had a bunch of PS1 games that I ended up selling. Because I'm like, what's the point of, like... Hoarding all of these. They're, they're gonna deteriorate at some point. And I kind of regret selling them now, but not fully. Because I think uh, it's gonna be a long time before they actually, you know, deteriorate. Okay. Sure is a lot of platforming. Don't tell me I need to drop that one, too. And they were all Dummy Man signs, too. And this is the third one, Dummy Man 3. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> there are sequels to this shit. Maybe I can make it. Maybe. Okay, turning is kind of... Gonna load. So, we need to find- wait, there's something around here, apparently. It was an encounter. <laughs> hey, <hurry up>! Nice. <clears throat> okay, where's the goddamn dummy man sign? Oh, there it is. <laughs> This is the second or third time I went here now. Are we gonna have a Dummy Man 4 sign? Please stop. 
Okay, this should be it for real this time. No cap, as they say. Whoa. <laughs> okay, here we go. Dummy man Gaiden. Okay, and there we go. Okay, there better not be a d dummy man for. Is combat in this game really running to... Now, there's actual combat, but... Uh... The helicopter is also an option if you don't want to fight. Winning a fight gives you adrenaline, which you can use to disarm traps. But this level has no traps. What the f- Wait, did I fall off? I thought that was ground. Okay, let me just- Please tell me it takes me back to where I was. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Wait, how much time did I take so far? Oh, we're way past the goal. God damn. <laughs> we got this. We got this. This is going to be it. This is the attempt. Okay, yeah, I thought that was... No, okay, I see it now. All this for gas. Wait a minute. I think... I'm screwed, actually. I need a gas tank, if I remember right, and I don't have one. Wait. Where do I get the gas can from? Did I even get one? Or wait, maybe I used the flamethrower on it, not, not the gas can. Hold on. Okay. Okay. No, wait, what's the... Wait, how do you use the flamethrower? Hold on. Oh, oh, there we go. Rachel? We need to talk. I need to be closer. Maybe the worm was the... It was the worm we made along the way. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, no. Worm, will you please stand up? No. Oh, the, uh, the aiming is uh, a bit rough. Okay, we're doing it. Any second now. Nice. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Holy shit. We gotta get in the worm's face. Just like that.
It should be okay if we take, like, late damage and whatnot now, because this, this is pretty much the end of the level now. One more hit, I guess? Watch. If you were not sold already, you, you will be now. Thank you, thank you, Gwento. Maybe it was the worm we made along the way. Rachel! I've missed you so. You appear to be okay. Oh, that's a relief. At last, we can be together forever. Let's go back to hell. Hey, you! Let's go back one. to hell. Thank you. I'll never forget your kindness. Let's go back to hell. <laughs> uh. Oh, there we go. Hide the pain, Harold, and his worm, yeah. Isn't it a touching story, guys? <laughs> okay. Oh, I guess we can just traverse the, the thing now. We don't have to worry about falling. Yeah, that's his child. That's his baby, Rachel. <laughs> Yo, Ken Rob, how you doing? Okay, and this is gonna be how we escape. Fuel the car with gas. And off we go! <laughs> Easy clap. Okay, how much do we get? I feel like I fucked up a lot. Oh, not as much as I thought. Okay, just like five thousand short of the full amount. I'll take it. God, I love this theme so much. It's almost like a reward, you know, for making it back to the amusement park. <laughs> Automatic operation, blood transfusion, transfusion, enter. Okay. <laughs> Let's get more upgrades, shall we? Uh, this is supposed to be a horror game, yes. Okay, so... Let me get another bleed upgrade. And maybe another... Oh, adrenaline is expensive, holy shit. Um, that's pretty much all I can afford for now, so I'll get that. We can spend the rest for uh, items. And there's the Operation cutscene again. Man, this game is like the definition of like this fucking weird passion project that just has a lot of personality. Like there will be a lot of moments that are like, what the fuck am I looking at? What is this shit? Who wrote this? But man, there's nothing like it. Da, 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 da. Okay, let's go to the shop. Let's see... Yeah, this is a Japanese game. One, two... One, two... One, two... One, two... And... Let's get something for the adrenaline as well. I think that's gonna be good enough. Let me save now. We have how many levels? Three left, I think. Three levels left. And man, they are a trip. A drug trip, even. 
<laughs> this is as much as horror as Dead Rising. Yeah. Like, horror by definition, I don't think has to be like, oh, fuck, it's like a million jump scares. Scary. Like, oh. Like, what the hell is this design? Kind of spooky. Horror is like, you know, if it has things that, well, fall under the definition, like, you know, monsters, gore, shock, disgust, I guess, then it's horror. It can be campy, cheesy, and funny. Okay, so those were the first two movies. Now we have a bunch over here. So these are locked for now, you can't actually see them. Here's gonna be- he's the next one, fellas. Wood Puppet. Boogie's Fun Movies. Cut in Pieces, Still Warm. Starring George McLeod Woodcutter. Wood... What? Wood Poker? What the hell is that? Randy Fairbanks. Sound familiar? That's the last friend. Writing, Michael Reynolds. Casting, Michael Reynolds. Editing, Michael Reynolds. Music, Michael Reynolds. Bro thinks he's Kojima. Sheesh. <laughs> Wood puppets. Wait. There's two P's. I love the misspelling in this game. <laughs> George McLaughlin knew there was more to life than running a sawmill. He loved what he did, but he needed better equipment. He'd make the finest, fastest chainsaw man has ever seen. That chainsaw instantly would tear through wood with a nice clean cut and would make him the envy of anyone in the lumber business. He knew just the tree to cut to prove the merits of his product. It was 800 years old. 800? And tough as nails. He took a picture of himself in front of the tree and then started to saw. Suddenly a face appeared on the tree and it swallowed him. He was presumed lost in a wilderness or eaten by a bear. No one cared. No one cared because he was a loner anyway. <laughs> Bro! <laughs> No one cared because he was a loner anyway. Imagine saying that in a report. New workers took over the mill and everything went smoothly until seven years later, when a hundred workers mysteriously disappeared. The relatives of the missing workers soon began receiving wooden boxes. The moment they opened them, a maniacal wooden doll jumped out and chased the terrified families. They used pans, sticks, or hammers to smash the dolls as best they could. Ironically, those wooden dolls spewed blood and Ironically. The people out even more. They called them wood puppets and hoped they had seen the last of them. Who, uh... Bro, the sound... Like, the sound design in this game is so good. <laughs> uh. Wood puppets. To the challengers, break into the Maklashlan lumber mill and solve the enigma of the wood puppets. Also, prove what happened in the disappearance of Maklashlan. Okay, can do. A hundred and twenty thousand. Let's go. We'll go with Eroko as usual. Uh huh. Uh huh. So, we're back to having actual traps in this map, and we have to look out for them. Oh, we already have one. Let me guess, the car? Oh wait, I don't have the horror monitor. I actually don't remember where it is here. Uh-oh. Wait, six cents. No, I think this is an encounter. Does anyone remember where it is? In the chat, if anyone knows the game. We had one person earlier, actually. Uh... Oh. Oh! Okay. Alright, I'm gonna have to try and find it if I can. Whoa! 
okay. That's one hell of a tree. Uh... Dummy man. Okay, I'm definitely gonna try and escape with a helicopter. Oh! <laughs> this is not a great start. Nice. So I think if the horror monitor shows up, every one of the senses um, lights up. Oh, item? Oh, Hassie, I'll take that. Mm. Horror monitor, where you at? Not here, I guess. Can you go in here? Yes, you can. God, I forgot if the horror monitor was in there or outside. I'm gonna check just in case. Oh. A deep breath. Okay, I'll take that. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make a save here. Just in case I don't find it going in. Wait, at the very start of the level, go to the left? Staff only. Oh, thank you, thank you so much. Mm. Don't think that's here, but I want to make sure. <laughs> Probably a trap here. It might actually be inside the building. Because I don't think there's a staff only sign here. Let me check in here. Or wait, no, that can't be right. Yeah, this is stage three. The wood puppet, or whatever it's called. You know what? I'll tank whatever's in here. That's a lot of wood. Hmm. No, it's fine. Whoa. <laughs> That's a big storm, goddamn. Okay, it has to be somewhere. No. God damn. Thank you for just running around me, dummy man. Okay, if it's not here, I'm gonna just make this like an explorer save. If it's not here, I'll load the save that I made earlier. Yeah, I don't think... Bruh! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Didn't expect it to be that... Uh, hidden, I guess, if you want to put it that way. But yeah, that's literally, like, right next to the... Start. Okay, here we go. Uh, sorry for wasting a lot of time on this, by the way, but this is absolutely essential. I wasn't close to it! No, 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 wait, wait, wait. 
We gotta do this again. Let me make another save just in case it does that again. Should be good now. You've been struck by. You've been struck by a truck. Okay, now we can actually start the level. There we go. The mill. Mac Lacalo. How do you read that name? Mac. Mac Lachlan. Mac Lachlan. Mac Lachlan. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Sight. Something tells me it's one of these. You know, just... Or maybe not. Oh, it was... Okay. Holy shit! <laughs> and there's another one, apparently. Somewhere. McLaughlin, McLovin. I'll go with McLovin. Nothing special. Artificial plasma. Hello, my name is George McLaughlin. Hello, George. I came to this beautiful forest seven years ago as a woodcutter. That's really all I knew how to do. Oh, shit. <laughs> Not George. Wood. What? Okay. Oh, I think that's an encounter with the other guy. Or wait, maybe... I think it is an encounter. I'm not gonna go near him. I was thinking maybe it could be a weapon, but I don't think so. Hmm. Calculator? What the- What does that do, actually? I don't know. Uh... Oh, the probability of dying by shock or fainting from the next trap. Huh. Never even noticed that. Sight. The blood, maybe? That is one. Cool. Mm. Cool. Holy shit. <laughs> There's a lot of traps here. Cool. Hmm. I want to aim closer to me, but wait. No, not there, I guess. Okay. I was like, maybe the jank is preventing me to look at that tree. Cool! Oh shit. Okay. They got me. There's an item nearby somewhere. Discount ticket. Sick. I actually- did I use it the first time? I don't think I did. Injection. Hmm. All right. What is this? Uh oh. <laughs> A wood puppet.
<laughs> He's T posing. <laughs> Run, Erica! Okay. He does have a long animation. Let me just trigger it. There we go. Or, well, the first one was longer. Nice kick. That's the one I want him to do. Come on. That's a short animation. There we go. Gonna commit this time. Nice. The T pose attack. Some days just have you feeling like that. Do we agree or no? Randy! Our friend! The wood box, wooden box, reads Randy. It's also addressed to his home. Uh oh. So yeah, like the park does all of this shit and you're wondering, how is this still functional as a park? Randy! It's Randy! He got turned into a puppet. <laughs> Uh-oh. Someone's excited to chop him down. Oh, I didn't even have a chance. So without the horror monitor, you have to tank everything? Basically, yeah. To my knowledge. Emergency first aid. No, we don't need to go. I don't even have the money anyway. Uh-oh. Okay. A save point, nice. <clears throat> yes, something. Artificial plasma. What does that do, actually? I still don't know. Is it for upgrades, too? Yeah, seems that way. The bleed rate. That's a lot of body bags. Oh. Oh. I hope that's it. Nice it is. Cool. <clears throat> Confirming defrost. Turbo in full gear. Number 106 entering skinning stage. That narration sounds like something you would hear in like a very... Okay. 106 has been skinned. <laughs> something you would hear in like a very blurry kind of spooky dream, you know what I mean? Piece of wood. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait, I have to kill him. Did I miss a weapon? I don't think I did. But here we go. Punches. I meant to run, actually, but... Yeah, this is a game that might scare you when you're, like, 12. But that's about it. Then again, honestly, you could say the same about a lot of RE games. <laughs> oh, did I miss the axe? Oh, no. So it was... It wasn't an encounter, after all. Ah, 
Actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna go back for it. Yeah, this is way early um, in the map, but missing the weapon, I think, is a big deal. <clears throat> Wait, did I take the horn monitor? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, nice. Yeah, cheating. How could he? <laughs> I think he can skip stuff, so we'll be fine. But yeah, I, sh I should have taken the risk and checked the woodcutter guy. Yeah, how could he do this? <laughs> Listen, guys, I'm just saving time for me, for you. I think that's all the traps. What? Bruh. <laughs> okay. Cool. It wasn't... See how the traps change, by the way? Let's skip that, get the memo, and then get the weapon. Who hold when the cut the tree, go to cut the tree, and I got to cut the tree, cause I love to cut the tree. He can sing. Yo, ho, ho, and I'm out of control, I'm gonna cut the tree. <laughs> oh no. Hey, what did he do to you? Damn it. Hmm. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna heal the bleeding. Okay, now we're set. Okay. It wasn't the blood this time. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna scan everything. Fuck this. Cool. Yeah, RE4 was spooky because of the chainsaw guy for me as well. Way back. that one like last time <clears throat> at least we don't have bleeding for now alright okay we can miss that encounter we know that it's an encounter <clears throat> there's Randy There's a trap this time. There wasn't any last time, right? She about to pass out now. Uh, she passes out at 200. In combat. Not sure about outside. Yo, Shadow, how you doing? I should probably actually take something for that. Okay, let me save again. <clears throat> and speaking of emulators though oh shit I missed something save states save so much time it's not even funny ah uh, this is on the dreamcast Thank <laughs> you. 
same trap. Okay, now we can fight this dude. <coughs> Whoa, okay, that was quite a lunch. Ah, <laughs> the blood. <laughs> cool. She's my Laba L bleed. Make you fill anyone. Go for the description, bad. Okay, there's something here somewhere. Cool. cool. Yeah, whoever thought of save states. Great person. Body assembly line open. Body assembly line open. I've seen takes that if you beat a game not using safe states, you're not a real gamer. What is a real gamer? What's the definition of a real gamer? Spending 10 plus hours of unnecessary time when you could avoid that with safe states? I mean, sure, go for it. <laughs> but I'm gonna be using those. Uh... C4 line, type B, complete. Whoa. Half-life mods? Uh, not really. Depends on the mod, I guess. Like, afraid of monsters, cry of fear, maybe. Cool. What? Oh, faces. Nice. <laughs> okay, I need to do something about the heartbeat. I guess I'll walk for the rest. Horror mods. I mean, it depends. You can suggest stuff on the Discord in the horror channel. Wait. Faint. Right. I wonder if he can find the speed ladder in this map to uh, escape faster. Hey, hurry up! Uh oh. Can he do that animation again over here? There we go. Why is there a helicopter ladder inside? You know, to escape battles. Makes sense, right? <laughs> Randy's brain. Bruh. <laughs> oh my god, these guys. Stop. You ever just find your friend's brain somewhere? Hey, hurry up! Hey, hurry up! Hey, hurry up! Okay, wait, uh... So that's an item that you can actually miss. So I'm glad I checked that area before I came here. Um... A keypad. Oh, we put the piece of wood here. So, depending on whether or not you take the brain, you get either a good ending for this stage or a bad ending. How did she even know that's Randy's brain? What, you don't know how your friend's brains look, look like? 
Not a real friend. Not a real friend. Wait, what? Wait, hmm. I actually don't know the code for this. Huh. Wait. Uh, is this tank controls? No, actually. Three, two, two, one. Okay. What? Wait, did I? Yo, thank you for the nine months, Jorio. Thank you, thank you. Wait, is this your birthday? Three? Wait. Uh, pieces of... Two by four. Wait, is this supposed to be some kind of big brain? Uh, puzzle? Hmm. Wait a minute. No. Am I just supposed to wait? Now I was thinking the entry number, but I don't know about that. Um let's, let's try it, I guess. Are you gonna stream Gaiden? Oh yes. Akhtar Nasman Winitab Unik Amrika. Okay, does anyone get this? I'm trying to think, but, uh... Brain taken from Randy Fairbanks' head. A friend of Erica's. Okay, so... Wait. Hmm... I tried in putting 3, 2, 2, 1, but it doesn't work. Um... Yo, Firebird. Hmm. Hold on, maybe I missed something. Three zero zero five. No. Wait, I wonder what's the logic behind this. Can I just look it up? <laughs> zero, 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 zero. No. One, two, two, three. Let's try that. If this doesn't work, I might look it up. Nine. Wait a fucking minute. Wait, I, I thought of a number close to that earlier. Hold on. Nine, two, two, three? No, wait, nine. Right, so wait, 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 wait. That's actually what I did earlier. I multiplied uh, the code by three because three dollars. But how is the last one three? It's one. Like, you know, the... Shouldn't double of that be two? How? <laughs> Listen up, my wood cutting slaves. You'd better be careful when you start tossing those humans in here. It's easy to oh my. Lift. 
And then... That's embarrassing. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't think you'd like that now. Wow. My brain was almost onto something until it wasn't. Holy shit. As you can tell, I'm not very good at math. <clears throat> We're a wood puppet! And we're T-posing. So you might be wondering, what the fuck just happened? How is this gonna work? Oh, you'll see. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this game. Oh. What do we have? Cool. Smell. Cool. cool. Even in this form, she's like, cool. Not phased at all. I used to own a Dreamcast, but never this game. My dad probably had one. I'm not sure. He used to buy a lot of, like, gaming-related stuff. I know he had a Sega Saturn, but I'm not sure about, uh... Uh, what's it called? A Dreamcast. Probably did, though. Oh. Hold I barely had a chance. <laughs> what? What? Bruh. My heart rate. Yeah, five weeks until Gaiden. Isn't that crazy, guys? Hmm. I'm gonna get something for the bleed and the heart uh, rate as well. Uh... Will you upload a video of Kason in the game? I might showcase most stuff in a stream. I'm sure a lot of people are gonna upload videos of different stuff though, individually. I might upload sep separate videos of stuff like karaoke. Maybe a guide, you know, stuff like that. But we will see. Nothing? No. I plan on getting 100%. Yakuza yeah, 0 and 6 before Gaiden comes out. Best of luck. Woodman and woodcutter. That's a lot of woodcutters. always have bangers at this park. Oh, there's something. Hunting manual. This is scary game, right? It's a horror game. But whether or not it's scary is something else. Would you try the Sully mod? Yeah, so the modder actually reached out to me. They're making a copyright free version. So, we'll see. Official Wood Puppet Hunting Guide for Woodcutters. In the hunting, the objective is to hunt down wandering wood puppets. Prizes will be awarded. Participants should read this guide carefully. Basic rules. A point is added after beating a wood puppet. A prize is given based on points. Player is disqualified if beaten by a wood puppet. Uh, Yao Lido? Yes. Point system. Score differs depending on the types of wood puppets. You hunt for types and points, please refer to the following page. Type A gives most points. Type A, human inside, speaks and runs away if chased, 30 points. Type B, stares without speaking, simple attacks, 10 points. Type C, brainless, speaks gibberish, behaves oddly, 2 points. 
prices. Gold chainsaw, three kilogram of prime beef, manda mandragora. What the hell is that? Defeated whoop puppets will be dedicated to the Michael Clinic for anatomy purposes. Hmm. Sounds kind of sus, if you ask me. Hey, buddy. I see you're Eric Christie, and you're 18 years old. From this point on is a hunting area. There are a lot of woodcutters who'd love to axe you wood puppets into little pieces. Nice. So, see how he said she's 18. If you manage to make it through the hunting area alive, you'll turn back into a human again. Remember, as wood puppets, you can't jump. Yeah, I can't jump. Here's a list of people taking part in today's adventure. These friends will go to hell and back with you, so stick together. Take the list with you if you want. Well, what are you waiting for? Get going. The hunting's already begun. Okay. Let the hunt begin, I guess. Hunting manual, too. Guide for wood puppets. Basic rules. If you defeat a woodcutter and reach the goal alive, you will have a chance to return to human form. If beaten, you'll be disqualified. Listed in the appendix of this guide are wood puppets already registered for today's hunting. Good luck to you all. Appendix... Wait. Oh, the list. There we go. Number 919. Richard Anoptasio. Age 40. S salaried worker. Type A. Comment. I will reach the goal and return to human no matter what. Inspirational. Eleanor Ferens, age 38, housewife, type A. Comment, I'm dying, help me. Randy Fairbanks, our friend, age 16, high school student. Comment, gibberish, he lost his brain, get it? We have it. Dosko Taka Takagi, designer, 26. Any prize for wood puppets? Note, no prize for wood puppets. <laughs> okay. Little did he know. So... I was gonna say something. Oh yeah, Lilo's asking if this game is a classic. It's a cult classic, yeah. It has a following. And I also fell for the game. Yo, Slayton, how you doing? So, this is a dead end. Maybe there's an item here. Gabooey? I'm assuming that might be like a full heal or something. A crude stamina increasing drug made of an herb which grows in volcanic ash causes side effects. Well, that doesn't sound good, does it? Wait, how much is the time we need for this map? Oh, 50. We're like halfway through. I've been in this once a while back. More people should try it. Yeah, it's really fun. But my advice is to play it with a guide. Because there are some moments that are kind of frustrating when you don't know what's going on or you don't know what you should do. Uh, there's a level coming up later where it's easy to get lost as well. New banger dropped! Wake up, guys! <laughs> okay, hold on. Um, okay, while you guys are listening to this absolute banger, I will be right back.
How are we holding up? Doing good so far? Okay. Let's see how the journey of Eriko continues. And Randy, I guess. He's in this map as well. Okay. Is there anything here? Oh, I guess it's just another way. Is there someone behind me? You hear the footsteps? Okay, where do we go from here? I'm gonna assume that secluded spot has an item, so I'll go there. Or maybe it doesn't, but... Oh! He's quick, what the hell? Okay, so the wood puppet moveset is actually really fucking good. Hold on. Because, like, it's a lot of multi-hits. But... <laughs> Look at that. Like it's nothing. <laughs> God, let that sink in. You're better off fighting with, um, you know, the wood puppet freaking body instead of an actual body. <laughs> Yeah, can Akiyama do that? That's the question. Okay, let's see if there's anything here. Uh-oh, I hear someone following me. Okay, I shouldn't have come here. Oh, that's kind of scary. Oh, okay, well, we have the leg sweep, we'll be good. Oh my god. <laughs> you just destroy. Just like that. Cool. It'll bleed too. They ill bleed. They'll bleed. Man, I really wish this game got a sequel of some sorts, because it's just so unique. You never find anything like it. No, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, uh... Oh, that's a long way. I wonder... Hmm. I don't even know if you find items right now. I don't think you do. So I think what you want to do actually is take a lot of turns to confuse the woodcutters. I think. I'm not sure. Is there anything here by any chance? Yeah, so I, I, th I guess if we turn... No, never mind. Okay. I want to do the arm attack. How was that again? Oh! What those arms do? Damn! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god, he's dead. Cool! Okay, I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go, but, uh... Not up there. Helicopter! Wait, that's a dead end, isn't it? Wait... Hmm... 
Actually, wait, let me see what's in here. Might as well, why not? Yeah, the wood puppet is armed and dangerous. Oh my god, I love this voice I think so much. <laughs> this is truly a game of all time. So we can pick these up and I have no fucking idea what they do actually. Oh, uh. Yo, Kaden, how you doing? Voracious appetite for withered trees. Okay. Oh, 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 right, right. We can use them to go upstairs. Oh, uh... If you're wondering, by the way, that was a brainless Randy. That's who it was. <laughs> he has no brain, so literally he can't speak. That explains the note from before as well. Oh, uh... And boom. Like it's nothing. What happened to the developer of this game? Did they go under? I know the company ended up shutting down. Um, I guess they didn't do so well. But also, one of the key people working on this game passed away shortly after the game came out, so feels bad. I'm good, thank you. Oh, uh, oh, uh. Hell yeah. Like, how can you have a bad night when this game is up? <laughs> wait, is she... Why is she tilting her head like that? Oh, no, wait. A save box? Hell yeah. Steak dinner? Let me check the map real quick. What's the bar below the screen? So the green one is your health. The red one is your bleed meter. The left is adrenaline you use to scan traps. And the right is the heartbeat. What do we think of this banger? Oh shit. We got this. So the leg attack is the most nimble, but uh, the arm attack is like really powerful. I want to use some items now. If only I had an Amazon. I wonder if this is worth it. Hit points and heart rate. Uh. Okay, and we'll use this. Okay, I'm gonna make a save state here, just in case. Do, 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 do. So wait, where the hell am I supposed to go now? Oh. 
I think I see. Down, 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 down. Why is this beat so good? Someone's following me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't think this is the right way. No! Duh, 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 duh. Oh! And just like that. Yeah, it is kind of like Mokujin, isn't it? <laughs> Wood. Okay, I need to kind of walk, I guess. Blade is almost out. So wait. Oh wait, that's a dead end. Oh, I see. Or wait, do I? What the hell? I I'm actually lost. <laughs> No, wait, 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 wait. No, yeah, that was the right way, I'm pretty sure. Oh, no. Oh, my God, there's a lot of them. No, you can't uh, use the helicopter in this state. Cool. What game is this? It'll bleed. It's a very beautiful game. I think this is it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Someone's on me already. Damn, they're fast. Rah! Oh no. What the hell is this area? Oh man, this is bad. This is bad. Oh, the wind-up. There we go. Bruh, just die! Holy shit! Oh my god. There we go, finally. We need a what game command. The thing is that the name is in the title. I feel like a command is not gonna change that. It's just one of those streaming things. Okay. Need to go there. Wait. Oh, my, I've been going the wrong way. Wait, I'm glad I saved, actually. Let's load. So, wait. I think I know where I need to go now. Someone's behind me. Yeah, so I'm supposed to go to the right here at first. Now watch this. What's going on over there? Surgery. Uh-oh. <laughs> Dummy man. Holy 
damage. Uh oh. They have the moves down. Okay, one. Oh, both are down. Sick. How many hours for this game? If you know what you're doing, six hours and a half, seven hours. Listen to this. <laughs> we used Randy's brain. Let's go. Yeah, I'm sad. I couldn't recognize anything because I had no brain. Calm down, Randy. <laughs> Everything's gonna be fine. You'll see. Whoa, you're Erica? You came here just in time. I'm sick and tired of looking like this. Let's get out of here. <laughs> and there is Randy, fellas. Couldn't recognize anyone because I had no brain. It's okay, Randy. We might not be human anymore, but it's okay. Just watch. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, I'm almost out of the bleed thing, so I'll uh, walk it out for now. Ah, oh, I love the voice acting in this game. I wonder if I can still have woodcutters getting on. I guess. I guess they still are around, I'm not sure. So I think now we can go to the exit. No, I think it was there. Uh oh. Let me not uh, rush this. second now. There we go. <clears throat> Which had better voice acting? This, Shenmue, or House of the Dead 2? God, that's a difficult one. <laughs> Wait, can I still not go? Oh, oh, I can, okay. I guess even before I could, but I thought it was blocked. Go again. Man, House of the Dead too. This is a game I haven't played in so long, but, uh... We're meeting G over there. There we go. <clears throat> cool! So, nothing in here. That's not for here. Another one? Yep. Oh, that's another attack.
Man, I don't think I have anything for bleeding. No, wait, I do, I do, I do. I think it's the heart rate that I don't have much for anymore. I think we should be close to the end now, though. Okay. Sick. House of the Dead 2 Remaster should be out at some point. They did talk about that, right? I think they confirmed both a remake of... Um, one, which is already out, and then two. House of the Dead Overkill. I was thinking of getting that, actually. Cool. cool. I think there's another encounter coming up. <laughs> they really love to hide. Oh, I need to heal. Oh, shit. Wait, can, can I not at the moment? Wait! <laughs> oh, no. Oh. It's like that goon attack from Yakuza 7 where he falls. not heal? Wait. Oh no. Strength empty. <laughs> yeah, gonna load. Wait a minute. Fuck it. Yeah, I think I have to save Randy again. Was there a save point that I got into? No, there wasn't. I have to do this again. Man, should have save stated again. I actually need to check if I can use the menu. I should be able to. Okay, so... Wait, can I really not? Huh. I guess I can't. Okay, I'm gonna load again. I feel like I'm missing something. I should be able to. Okay, Randy should be right around this corner. And... One of them is down. Nice. Okay. Should probably make another safe state here. Now, before I forget, there was an item here as well. I'm gonna pick that up. There we go. All the way down, right? How did you find out about this game? So, initially, I'm pretty sure a few people from my channel told me I should check out this game, but I didn't. And then a while later, I found um, a YouTuber that I watch, and he happened to play this game. And I'm like, you know what? 
I heard this game's name quite a lot. Let me check out the game. And there it was. One of the games of all time. Okay, I'm gonna make another save here. This is starting to become like Subterranean Castle. Oh, come on. That track has nothing on this. I think, unfortunately, we also have to go through all of these fights. Maybe the leg attack is the way to go. I'm thinking of going for S plus professional in separate ways, then common sense kicks in. Man, I love RE4, but the fact that it takes like freaking five attacks to stun an enemy is just too much. That's like my least favorite part about it. Scarlet Dawn. Which one is that again? Let me save again. Oh shit. I forgot about this. We just saved it. Let's uh... Cape Goat Mary. Might be wondering, what is that? Let's have a look, shall we? Mary dies in place of you. This can only be used once. So basically, a sacrifice stone from Yakuza. So yeah, that, that's how it looks like here. House of the Dead 5, 2018, okay, it's still, I see. Man, god, a remake of 2 would be so cool. I enjoyed 1's remake, but I really wish they had more, like, characters. Though I think with House of the Dead 1, there weren't multiple characters in the initial release. Uh, they probably added that in the PC version, right? I think, not sure. But that was really cool, I like that about the game. Uh, okay, let me... Steak dinner, and... Should we use this now, or... I don't know. <clears throat> okay! You guys wanna see something cool? So seeing this, what's your first thought? I'm never gonna go into this, right? Well... You can go in. We fixed her! Just like that! 
Oh, uh, okay. Hmm. Welcome to Illbleed, ladies and gents. Oh, another one of these. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Should I use the bleed thing? Nah, no, I think I can take a few more hits. Let me save just in case. Damn, this stream was long. Oh, this is nothing yet. I think we're like halfway through the game. Connection, not the oil pump. No, that's not the problem. Sorry, uh, we're having trouble getting the boss character out. <laughs> uh, hold on a second, please. Hey, we got another customer waiting here. Hurry up. Try turning on the switch again. Okay, here goes. <laughs> I love how goofy yeah, this game nothing is. Doing. This is gonna be a nightmare. You over there, go ahead and jump into it and keep going. I'll try to get it to work from here. Uh-oh. <laughs> Yo, thank you for another super chat, Dojima. Thank you, thank you. Okay, here we go. So the pattern here, I'm pretty sure, you hit like twice, dodge, Wh what? That was a late hit. Okay, that was a late dodge. Oh, I remember you can't, oh my god, I remember you can't use heals in the middle of the fight, I don't think. Okay. The tree meme, yeah. And this came out in 2001, keep that in mind. So, stops bleeding. Let's use a Hazzy, why not? Okay, let's hope for the best now. What? Bruh! That was a late hit! <laughs> oh no. We should be able to do this though, hopefully. Almost. One more hit, I guess. Let's go! That face, though, goddamn. <laughs> Poor employees, am I right? They were just doing their jobs. But hey, this is Ill Bleed. Oh, my name is George McLaughlin. I can put you know what happened there? That was supposed to be the introduction of the tree. Because of the glitch that happened earlier, only now it started introducing itself. That's what that was supposed to be. <laughs> this game, bruh, this game. Hey, 
here we go. Does anyone have a forest around them like this? Well, not exactly like this, but you know, a big forest nearby. Clear! Oh yeah, the game is 100% self-aware and I love that about it. Your prize is... Oh, that's a lot. Okay. Back to this banger, baby. By the way, there's a there's an area around here. You might be wondering what the hell is, is in this like hidden place. This is the tutorial area. And it doesn't make sense for it to be here. You know what I mean? Like lesson 1. Welcome to Elblade. I'm Michael Reynolds. I'll show you the most important thing for you to survive. Please go forward and to the right. So yeah, there's a bunch of stuff here. But uh, yeah, we, we already know everything at this point. <clears throat> 15 minutes by car. Damn. Okay, um, let's upgrade Erica a little bit. I have a lot of people suggesting ideas for emotes, but it's really difficult to actually put some of them uh, into, well, an, like an image. I'll take one of that. I think we're good. No, wait. Oh, she's maxed, okay. Um, I guess we'll take that. And there we go. My uncle got chased by one wild pig once there. Oh, damn. Hope he didn't get hurt. Leon, is this a horror game? Yes. Okay, we should have a lot of money for heals now. So... Let me get another one of those. And... Mm -hmm. I think we're good now. I mean, technically, I can just use the rest. Because I'm not going to be using them anywhere else. One, two, three... Yeah. Um. All set, baby. <clears throat> nice. Well, good thing he got away from it. Okay. The next movie. Killer Department Store. Go to number one. Starring Donard Cashman with Mark Gibson, Will Cooks, Steakman, QT Mary, Inda Kaplan, Michael Reynolds Production. Directed by Michael Reynolds. Okay. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, I needed to save actually. Hold on. a drugstore doesn't sell salad. Is it even a drugstore? You tell him, Hammond. Okay. Huh. 
<clears throat> I actually kind of want to show you guys some of the other characters, but I kind of just can't afford to. I spent everything on Nerico. Yo, thank you for the three months, Kelchi. What the hell is a stake, man? Stick around to find out. Uh... Child Palace, coming soon. Okay, just in case, I'll save it with this as well. Um, okay. Killer Department Store. If you play, pay close attention, you can hear the narrator actually messing up his line and re like saying it again, and they didn't cut that out. If you catch it, you catch it. But, uh, listen close. There was a big blowout sale going on at the Cashman department store, which needed something to bail it out of heavy debt. What seemed like a sale was actually a deadly disguise for a mass murder by store manager Donald Cashman, who freaked out after a run of bad business. He killed all of the customers and stole their money and valuables. Damn. His warped money. In his warped mind, he figured they owed it to him since he couldn't make enough money in sales. Bro, what kind of... When the police arrived and figured things out, they shot Cashman on sight. That should have ended the terror, but it didn't. The sheer power of Cashman's hatred and his ruthless obsession with money brought him back to life as a horrible monster. He's still making products, but this time he breathes evil into them, turning the products into monsters themselves who suck up a customer's money and soul. Cashman's out there somewhere, waiting for the next customer, as he secretly sits in a safe, counting his money. I was actually kind of absent-minded, I didn't pay attention. Okay. To the challengers, punish Cashman, who crept up here from hell for money. Banish him from this world forever. Be aware that he does not notice people who do not have a certain amount of money. Okay. A hundred and fifty thousand. So they pay you at the start of this stage here. And the traps in this level will keep stealing money from you. That, that's the gimmick with this level. Okay, guys, you want to hear some epic voice acting? Yeah, dude! Yeah, dude. Randy is so epic. <laughs> what? That was quick, bro. <laughs> Sheesh. Hey, buddy. Yeah, dude. I want to just get the horror monitor to show you guys something. That's not it. That's it. I want you guys to see what he says when he spots a trap. What the hell? Bro, there's nothing. Dummy popcorn. Oh. Run on! Run on! <laughs> I love it. Run on! Run on! Run on! <laughs> Smell. Okay, that's enough. I'm gonna go back and select Erika. By the way, every single character has different dialogue, if you're wondering. Like, if a map has voice acting, then 
you know, they have their own lines and all that. So that's pretty cool. Right on. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Caution bomb. Secret note. First save in grass. Second save for Mary, both near man-eating ghost. A large evil spirit eats money by the third save. Hmm. What did they mean by that? Yo, Jeff. You missed a lot of stuff, but there's still a lot of good stuff coming. Whoa. I haven't seen that one before, actually. Suicide note. Okay, this is a banger note. Mr. Cashman, please let me apologize for not being able to satisfy your intention. Please blame me as assistant manager for the failure of the Cashman department store. Therefore, I will kill myself to compensate for the failure. About the memo with the location of the hidden safes, I disposed of it in the garbage, so please don't worry. If there's any chance, please let me help you again as an assistant manager of the Cashman department store in my next life. Let us elevate ourselves to become the richest in Nebraska. Bye for now. It's been an exciting 38 years of my life. Lastly, I would like to praise the Cashman department store. Long live Cashman and the store. Regards, Edward Gibson. <laughs> uh, are you gonna have a schedule? Not right now, but I'm planning to play a lot of different stuff. Curse. Wait, there's something else? Yeah, well, what is that? Oh. Green Flyer. Total amount is $1 million. Cash back sale today. If you buy $100 or more, you will get $100 back. Don't miss the opportunity. Many people are expected to rush the sales floor. We ask you to get a ticket at the entrance and enter in order. When you go back, please follow the floor attendant, who will guide you to the exit. Please note you may not be able to enter unless you have a lot of cash. <laughs> okay. <laughs> department store of conscience. We treasure all our customers. Cashman department store. Rich people only. So this was a trap last time. And it's not this time. Severed head. Cool. cool. Smell. Is it the same clown, maybe? It could be something else. Oh, it was a different spot this time. Cool. Smell. Stand? Yo, the scream masks. Nice. <laughs> cool. cool. Oh, something's around here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Run, Eriko. Damn it! Hey, 
Hey, hurry up! Okay. Jelly. Smell. Oh, there is a lot of stuff to scan here, goddamn. Bruh! <laughs> okay. Huh. Okay, we got one. Cool. Smell. Okay. Sight. Nice, we got it. Cool. That's a huge can, what the hell? What is that for? Skyrim Giants? Damn. Cool. cool. Oh. Oh, that was a hidden one, actually. Didn't get any, uh, notifications. Bakery? Wait. Hmm. Okay, I guess we can go there then. Sight. This is not looking good. Bruh! I tried to scan it. There was nothing. Smell. <laughs> Smell coming from the burger, maybe? <laughs> Stinky burger. Not the ketchup. <laughs> How did that make her bleed? Okay, so... Buddy! Waddle, waddle. Uh, I am the cake from hell. <laughs> but I need something more to be a complete cake. A cake I'd be proud to be. I feel like the top of my head needs something glorious, or should I say, glorious to crown me. What do you have that I could wear as a decoration? Hmm? Hmm? Let's see. I think I have just the thing. What better crown than a severed head? This is just what I needed. Complete at last! Thanks to you, I'm complete again. Why not take me with you? This head makes me look so fabulously fiendish, darling. By the way, for great strength and energy, why not take a bite of me? So... We actually can get the hell cake. And as far as I know, it's a full heal. So I'm definitely taking that. So, wait. Oh, there's a couple of things here. Okay, we got one. Oh, we didn't get that one. <laughs> oh. oh, my money! Oh no. <laughs> I'm 
encounter. You know what? I'll try to... Did we get a weapon? I don't think we did, did we? Yeah, we didn't. Wouldn't be a good idea to fight them. Man, he's quick. Hey, hurry up. <clears throat> Come on. Hey, hurry up. Come on. Man, that speed ladder would be really nice to have here. I meant to run, but, uh... Come on! <laughs> nice. How many traps are there? You never know. It's randomized. Sweet strawberry. Don't think I saw that before, either. I wonder if he can eat that. No. I think that's, uh... A thing you can give to the cake, but it's the wrong choice. And I don't know if you can use it. Probably not. Wait a minute. Whoa. I think you can find a weapon around here, actually. Hatchet. Hell yeah. I just... <laughs> okay. Wow. Bruh. The alerts are uh, a bit janky in this level. Oh no. My heart beats. Okay, the hatchet is good, but uh, I'm not doing so well. Okay, one of them died. I think we got this. Nice. Okay, okay. That was so close. We get some adrenaline back, so that's good. Cool. Okay, we need to heal stat. <laughs> I'm actually thinking of eating the cake. Uh, new taste, decorated with a freshly severed human head. Limited availability. Okay, so that's a full HP heal. Uh, but I need to fix everything else as well. Uh... Heart rate... There we go. I'm gonna save, just in case. Oh my god. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff here. Is there even a point to coming here? Baked cake. I'm assuming you can't eat that either. So the only reason you want to come here, I think, is for the hatchet. Yeah. Uh... Which, if that's the case, I might just reload, honestly. Yeah, I'll do that. <laughs> 
We should be able to just go back now. Uh... Item? Nice. Man, you know what's the crazy thing about this game? Slight spoilers, I guess, but uh, there's New Game Plus, and he can't get the true ending in the first playthrough. And I think you get to keep the upgrades on your subsequent playthrough as well. Not sure. Oh boy. Chicken. Chicken. You can take an unlimited number. Now there's something. Pork. Mm. There's something we can pick ar around here. Probably is okay. Yeah, it's probably that. <sighs> Sight. Cool. Okay, uh... Beef. I'll take a couple of those as well. Huh. I wonder if we can find anything there, actually. I guess not. <laughs> Okay, we have a giant cockroach. <laughs> cockroach wants meat. Feed meat to the cockroach? Yeah. Huh. What is it feeling today? Let's start with chicken. Is this meat okay? Oh, it's okay. Cockroach enjoyed the meat. <laughs> it wants more meat. As far as I've heard, it's actually RNG how much meat it wants. Cockroach enjoyed the meat. It wants more meat. Feed the cockroach again? Sure. Beef. Damn, it's really going in on that on that meat. It wants more, <laughs> bruh. <laughs> okay, beef. Come on, you little shit. Just get out of the way. Okay. So hold on. I, I'm gonna go to pick more meat because there's another cockroach right there. I hope this one doesn't respawn. Okay, one, two... One, two... Okay. Yeah, an entire chicken is not worth- is not enough for a cockroach. An entire chicken, two pieces of beef, and two pieces of pork. It still wants more. Oh, here we go again. <laughs> Okay. Okay, you better not be- whoa! What?! What the hell was happening with the choices? 
I mean, sure, <laughs> I guess. I'll take it. He got out of the way. Hi there. Welcome to Mr. Meat Steakhouse. Hey, I see you brought your own meat. You can grill it up right here on my good old grill. Takes a lot of doing to cook all that meat, mind you. I'll make sure you're well done, too. What you waiting for? Get you and your meat up on there now, you hear? Alright. So, fun fact about this fight. When you, like, when you see the meat, you're like, oh, cool, that's a lot of heals, or something like that. Because you can pick it, like, an unlimited amount. So if you pick, like, 15, you have to fight all of them here. Which is a troll move by the devs. Damn, the range is, uh... A little rough. Okay, I think that should be it. So this next part doesn't make sense. Well, well, well. You're pretty good. Thanks to you, I can't get any more special orders of meat. That's just great. No more meat. And no use for you, that's for sure. Bruh, so I just... I did what you told me to do. What do you mean? Sheesh. <laughs> well, well, well. Alright. Back to the market, I guess. Those are some big melons. Goddamn. Okay, thank god we have the... The worms are back. Well, well, well. Hey, hurry up! Hey, hurry up! Nice, just barely. Smell. Bruh! <laughs> No more meat. And no use for you, that's for sure. So scram! Hey, hurry up! Onions. Damn, they're massive. What is this game? It's a horror game. You have to save your friends in a spooky amusement park. Anything there? No, I guess not. Cool. Over here. I don't think there's anything there. Are those carrots? Yeah, I think they are. Look at how massive they are. Damn. Uh. Go, where we go? Hurry up! Get past? Yes, we can. Uh, let me check the map. So we can go here and there. Is there anything here even? An encounter. <clears throat> oh, just the there we go. <clears throat> Yeah, I don't think there's anything you can get here, I guess. Those are big pineapples. Whoa. Bruh! <laughs> Leave my money alone. Damn, should've never approached those fucking pineapples. Okay, hold on. 
I'm gonna heal. I think there's a fight coming. Or, well, just in case there is one. Uh, heart rate. Mm. I think that's it. Yeah, I'm planning to beat this on one stream. We have just one level left, so... I mean, after this. And that's arguably the best one. Or probably the one that's gonna get the most reactions out of everyone. Okay, so I will save it here. It's also the most uh, narration-based, or na like, narration-driven story. So I think you guys are actually gonna love it. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be a boss fight, I'm pretty sure. Three worms? Bruh. Oh, the, the range is really close. Stay in place, goddammit. I have to really stick to them. And even then I got one hit. hit. That's very poggers. Oh my god. Haha, <laughs> bruh, stop. God, the range of this weapon really sucks. Oh, I think one of them is down. Sick. We're actually doing something. Okay, let me try to bring them all the way here. Okay, that's two. I think I did it. Please. There we go. Cool. cool. Okay. Oh, what a fight. Easy clap, yeah. Hmm. What a friendly looking face. Sure, I'll get on. <laughs> Why not? Okay, I need to do something about the blades. Um... 
also might as well heal, I guess. Mm, and... Okay. Might save it here. Kids World! Attention. Money of 200,000 and more is necessary to go on this floor. Bruh. Wait. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Hold on. I think there was something you could do around here. check the items that I have. I think I have less than like 5,000. So, pretty much nothing. Uh, hatchet. I should use this at some point. Come on, just walk in. No one's gonna notice. Just sneak past. No one's even here. So, hold on. I actually... Can't remember what to do here. I think there was some kind of uh, save you find. But, um... I thought that was a bit later. I guess not. No, I think it is, but, uh... Not sure how I'm gonna get that money, though. What do we have here? Blue memo. A phrase to unlock money. I ate six trees. Cryptic, huh? <laughs> what the? Oh, spiders. Oh, we can't escape, I don't think. Oh, we can. Human face spiders. Leave the park and come back, yeah. <laughs> oh! I think the machine gun actually sucks. Which is funny. So, this is Cashman, by the way, guys. Look at him. Calculator. So, I... Eight, six, trees! So, we're about to see a very sussy scene. But if it makes anyone feel better, it's not just for the female characters. The guys get it too. <laughs> Cannot tell anyone the numbers to open the safe. But if I forget them, I made it possible to acquire any time with that epic puzzle. Wait, it says there's something. Maybe it's just the safe. Oh, no. Caution bomb. Okay. Or maybe it's not now, actually. A hundred thousand plus. So, wait. Oh, now I can go. Sick. Okay, that, that was kind of weird. It showed him eating money, but I got a lot of money. Maybe he took just a little bit. Oh, we can skip that, sick. 
why did you eat six trees? I had to survive, somehow. Okay. Here we go! There's actually some references here. There's a trap right from the get-go somewhere. Watch this. Kids World. Killer Invader. A thousand dollars. Would you pay a thousand dollars to get your kid this toy? Sight. Killer Invader. Same thing. this UFO Robo I think there's a Dino Crisis reference somewhere site okay Magic Cat, Mr. Miracle. $9,000, bruh. <laughs> $9,000 to get your kid. Oh, there, there it is. This hat. Look at it. That would probably cover your kid's whole head anyway. Mr. Miracle, there he is. The man of the hour. Wait, miracle card? Ha what? Almost a hundred thousand dollars for this? No way. Mr. Cashman is a big scammer. <laughs> yeah, next level inflation is right. God damn. Oh, we got something. Magic stick. Four thousand four hundred forty-four point four do uh, dollars. Doing a good job avoiding the traps for now. Men got a dash sale super price. I don't think thousands of dollars is a uh, cheaper price, but you know, maybe it's just me. Can't scan anything else, so. Yep, okay. What does that say? Gatley? Panic? Gatley Panic. Mega Dream. Oh, now we're referencing consoles. Dogs. For those who know Blue Stinger, I'm pretty sure this is a reference to it. The bearded character looks like someone from that game. New soft. Oh, there we go. The Dino Crisis reference. Look, Dino. Just Dino. <clears throat> TVs. Uh oh. Yeah, Cashman is a scalper. Filthy, filthy scalper. And there's a console. Mega Dream. <laughs> Sixteen thousand dollars. Damn. Those games better be able to come to life for that price. Do they store a garden of Peak Peak in this store? Oh, you'll find something soon. And I think no one is gonna expect it. I actually don't know how soon it is, but yeah. Cool. Let me use an adrenaline item. The the plan is to try, yeah, spicy. Um, gonna try to stream as many as I can. We'll see how it goes.
That is a huge skateboard. And that is a huge ball. What? My money! Sight. <laughs> Kids world, by the way. And look who we have here. Toy Hunter. <laughs> and there's uh, Buzz, Potidon, and Cork. Man, I'm, I'm telling you, this game is gonna get better. Like, <laughs> who thought of this? Uh... Yo, Nimbus, how you doing? Salad! In the trash! Whoa. That's a lot of items in the trash, I'll take them all. Uh, horror games all month, does that mean four weeks of Dead Souls? Oh, you know it, buddy. I might actually stream that. check out my new product. But meanwhile, why not stop by my corner for a real good time? I can't wait for you to stop by and see me. We'll have lots of fun. Promise, don't be long now. I'll meet you in hide. Okay. New banger dropped. Let's go. <laughs> yet today. Oops, <laughs> don't pay any attention to me. On second thought, you really should listen carefully to what I have to say right now, as I won't repeat it. Got it? Okay. Listen up. You and I are gonna play a little game of tag. I get to tag, and you get to run. The battle begins when I tag you. You don't really think it's that simple, do you? Here's the catch. I hid four different Marie cards in four different places within this room. Okay. You have to collect all of them to open the gold door. You don't have any time to waste because there are strong spiritual powers coming from all of these Marie dolls. Their power will drain you of your energy in no time. <laughs> Uh-oh. You could even die. Whoa. <laughs> Got to be careful or boom, boom, out through the light. Now, let's do it. Okay, I'm definitely making a safe state here. Because uh, this is a maze-like section that might be annoying. So, yeah, look at, look at this place. So, I can guess where a couple of... Of the cards are right now. You have a, a few dead ends, I'm assuming. That's where you need to go. And I assume you can't stop the encounters here, so might as well just run. Oh. Card! Uh oh. That sounded like a dolphin. But uh, that was her laughing. Okay, so this is basically like the woodcutter section. You have to just kind of, you know, evade her if possible. Is she looking at... Uh-oh. Is she behind me? Uh-oh. I hope she walked away from there. Okay, she did. Rises Dungeon from Persona 4. Hmm. I need to play Persona 5 already on stream. 
Uh, okay, we have another dead end there, and then another dead end there. This one is closer, so I'm gonna go there first. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. No! That was a big brain move, actually. <laughs> so, remember the machine gun that I got? It kind of sucks. Like, it doesn't knock back the enemies. No, run! Bruh, the aiming! <laughs> Okay, maybe if I keep my distance, it's not so bad. Well, what? Oh my, okay, that, that was on me. <laughs> the aiming is a little... Uh... No, not that direction. Okay. So the machine gun isn't really that bad, after all. I think I just watched the streamer that kind of struggled with it. Okay. Darkwood. That sounds familiar, but I don't think I did. Okay, one more piece. You can even- uh oh Oh my god, the jump scare. You can even say, the One Piece. Okay. Cool. So we need to go straight ahead for a while. I think it's... S yeah, still up ahead. Yes, you do have infinite bullets, actually. So you can just go blasting. So, hold on. Infinite wealth bullets. <laughs> An infinite wealth, yeah, of bullets. I'm so hilarious. Please laugh, guys. Put a kick W in the chat if you left. Okay, let's use them. That's one. <laughs> At this point, you're the villain instead of the doll. I know, right? Do I have Kek wait on the list? No. Feels bad. <clears throat> Kek wiggle, huh? Oh, that one, yeah. <laughs> Look at it. Look at him dancing. Look. I hate to lose. But hey, you won. Too bad, but I dare you to come to my next fun filled corner. Don't expect me to keep my trap shut. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm going to save it. Hello! This toy corner is where we'll play hide and seek. Hide and I seek time! You find me. Simple, right? But if you think I'm hiding somewhere, just survey that area with the A button. But if you scan the wrong spot, you'll be shocked! Quite uh -oh. literally! So oh, be careful. I'm going to hide now. Close your eyes. 
Don't peek. When I say ready, open your eyes and start looking. Okay. Okay. Close your eyes. Are you ready? Wait, who the fuck is this? That's not Erica. Are you ready? Now I'm ready. Who is that? That's not me. So, apparently, the, like, it's actually random in which order you find her, so you might have to do every single trap. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! That was quick! I got lucky. How, how did you find me? That should have been impossible! One streamer I watched play this game said he once had to check literally every single trap. Oh! Oh shit! She's back! But yeah, he had to check like every single trap once. The view is not the best in this fight. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh-oh. The dolphin sound. Why is the doll bleeding? That's one question among many in this game. <laughs> oh, by the way, I just remembered. Before this level, I said there's two levels remaining, right? Now, after this level, there's two levels. In case I said that. But also, they're arguably the more interesting levels. Out of all of these. The evil dead logic, yeah. <laughs> Uh-oh. Man, she's powerful. Oh no, I'm too far. No, I meant to run! Oh, nice, nice! We did it. That doll could fill five banks. Blood banks, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, you are really something. I give up. You win. The way she's talking, look at her. <laughs> all the treasure you want from this room. All the treasure we want. You follow yourself just yet. I'll be waiting for you in the next room. Okay. <laughs> yeah, where's Herculean spirit when we need it? So you can actually find a bunch of stuff here. At least a couple of them. Mary's key. Amazon. And artificial brain. I think I'm gonna use the Amazon right now. There we go, full heal of everything. Closed with. Can you use the key here? No. Oh, there we go. Locked. Save point. A 
Is it true that it is possible to hear Saijima screaming for Baba in this game? Yeah, so when you stand in this spot... Listen to it. My stream deck decided to glitch out. So it's gonna be like 10 seconds late. Baba! Thank you, stream deck. That was... Not the best timing. Anyway. Okay, the last of Mary's challenges. But not the last of the level. You're here again. This will be our last chance to play together. Look, it's a jump rope. All you gotta do is jump into that jump rope as it's spinning around and use that A button to jump. If you can oh boy. jump ten times without missing. So you basically have to time your jumps for this one. <laughs> and if, if I remember right. Snagged in the rope just once. A poison thorn on the rope will kill you. For some I reason, Buster, they changed there? the jump button for this Lagging. particular moment. Let's begin. And I don't remember which one it was. Wait, let me save here. Because loading and then coming back would be pretty annoying. the blood wait look oh my god <laughs> that is actually evil dead levels of blood <laughs> god damn that blood though What? <laughs> okay, we got this. We got this. And then they slow it down for the last one. The troll. I hate to say this, but you beat me fair and square. Finally. Ooh, I feel like such a loser. You can take as much treasure as you want at the exit. Later, Gator. Later, Gator. Okay, is there even anything here? Ooh, salad. Ho ho ho! Another scapegoat, Mary. Mary stick. Okay, I think that's it actually. Scary. Okay, so there's a secret here and I'm glad I found this before I actually streamed. If you go to this portrait, a painting of a spooky old castle is hung on the wall. You can use the Mary stick here to reveal something. Please Mary, make my wish come true. Now watch this. Of course, you wouldn't know this on your first playthrough. This is completely optional. And there's a bunch of stuff like this in all of the maps too. I really like that. Like, you 100% will not see everything on your first playthrough. So remember the sus scene I was talking about before? It's gonna be here. Blackjack, sick, swan. So I think this is gonna be a code. J... Okay, so something one six swan. <laughs> oh, not this again. Uh oh. Oh, it's more of these things. Hey, hurry up! Hey, hurry up! Nice, no damage. Uh, 
a calculator. So wait, 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 guys, guys. The first one is supposed to be a number, but which one do you think? I know that the other one is one, six, and one. But... You're right, Reg. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so no matter who you pick, you see the same scene here. And uh, this is... Uh... Get off of her, damn it. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> uh, this is completely optional, by the way. All of this. But yeah, you get extra money from here, basically. Which is gonna help a lot. <clears throat> Worth it. Now, I'm gonna make a save here. Burn it. <laughs> yeah. Burn it, indeed. Wait, pregnant? What? Hey, what do you think he did? Damn it. Get your minds out of the gutter, damn it. What's the money for? You upgrade yourself, you get items for next levels. Holy. That's a lot of saves. So remember at the beginning, they said Cashman is in a safe? <laughs> There's the safe. So, as you can see, health infinity, so you can't kill him. No, 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 I meant to jump. There we go. Imagine playing this for the first time, not seeing a guide or anything about the game. Would you even know to come here? This is gonna be a banger cutscene. at this hour yeah what do you want i'm working here Ooh, jessica it's jessica you. no 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 everything's fine huh work <laughs> i'm not working no way man am i right call, am i right sure sure really <laughs> i don't know I bet you tell that to do you guys me. know someone like this no kidding uh, sure babe tonight oh, i'm there you can count on it there's only one more visitor to deal with Okay, while he's not looking, I'm gonna do a little something. Remote control. Can he even interact with him? I guess not, he's just really busy with Jessica. So this is one of the more unique boss fights, for sure. Because, I mean, well... You'll see. <laughs> cool. Cool. That's her reaction to this. So basically, you have to turn the thing and make it jump like that until it dies. What a boss fight, am I right? <laughs> and boom. Oh gosh, this cutscene. Mm. Oh, 
Watchman's on fire. I the fire. <laughs> Sorry. Ah, he's fire on here. fire. Crap. I'll call you back. Love ya. <laughs> we have a code nine here. I repeat, code nine. This is an emergency. Cashman's on fire, and the flames are spreading fast. There's no time. We need to evacuate the visitor now. Roger that. We're activating the emergency escape unit. Damn, that sucks, Reg. <coughs> hey, you! I'm gonna pull down the ladder. You gotta get out of here. Quick! Yo, the rescue helicopter! In an indoor building! Let's go! See, even the story acknowledges that ladder. Clear! <laughs> oh, look at the money I have, damn. Let's go. I actually had no... That, that wasn't a condition that I went over or, like, failed, so to speak. And here we are. Da, 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 da. Okay, so... How many levels did we go through? Was it three or four? So we had the, um... Jimmy's level. The baseball one. Baseball worm. The, uh... I feel like there's one I'm forgetting. Baseball. Worm. God, what was the third one again? Oh, the wood puppet. The wood puppet one. And then the market. Out of all of those so far. For those who, um... Well, which one was your favorite so far? <laughs> okay. God, she's gonna be a beast now. Look at all these upgrades. And then we can get even more. So this is maxed for her. And I think we'll still have a lot of money too. Man, she's gonna be a machine. God damn. Yeah, we can get more, pretty sure. God damn. Cashman was my favorite so far. Nice. Yeah, a lot of these levels are just so different. I like it. Okay, she is indestructible now. All right. Um. Small break time. We'll be right back, fellas. Stay hydrated or something.
Let's do this. Man, yeah, it would be really nice if this got a port, but, uh... The company responsible for the game cut down. I don't think it, like, joined any other company, so... I don't know if it's possible. I don't know if anyone even owns this IP. <laughs> Wait, the company that made it shut down a year after it came out, moved to... And that was shut down too. Okay. Yeah, I have no idea. Maybe no one owns it anymore. Okay, so... The second to last level, fellas. Killer Man. <laughs> Destroy. One by one. Starring Bale Logos, Dwight Lai, Boris Carlin, with Helena Chandler. Chandler, yeah. Directed by Michael Reynolds. Screenplay by Michael Reynolds. Produced by Michael Reynolds. Killer Man. Let's see what it has to offer. It took place in New York in 1935. America was just coming out of the Great Depression when something happened which shocked the world. The papers called it the Killer Man Serial Murders, which began with the killing of the CEO of Manhattan Mutual Bank. The citizens of New York started to panic as there seemed to be no pattern or motivation for what would turn into 39 murders in less than a month. Since no one knew the killer's identity, people started calling him Killer Man because he always left the same trademark on his victims, a bright red star or killer mark. Then there was nothing, no more murders, at least ones that could be traced to Killer Man, until 66 years later. He was back. He had to be. His mark was found on the face of a utility repair man near Central Park. The Manhattan Police Department immediately launched a special task force to investigate the case and hopefully prevent such a thing from happening again. Jack the Ripper in the 30s, I guess. Yeah, this game is pretty unique, right? For sure. Kill. Kill. Fifty thousand. Uh -huh. So this starts in a theater. You might be wondering why. So this is actually a very unique stage in that it kind of breaks the fourth wall, I guess. It's basically a movie gone wrong. You'll see what I mean. Killer man Mark. A worker in the projection room has apparently been murdered recently. There's a strange mark on his face. Uh oh. Scott. <clears throat> um, Ace Attorney fans are gonna love this one. So basically, you have a murder mystery in the park, not, you know, in the movies. This is supposed to be, uh,. Outside of all of that. Nice. I think there's nothing else here. A password. <laughs> okay. Don't stop, it says. What? Huh. 
That's a very long tunnel for the stuff. So if you come here, you'll notice, like, these are basically just the stuff they use in the other levels. So this is literally supposed to be the backstage for the, uh, the amusement park. Which is pretty interesting. And there's another enemy. Part-timers, aren't you? No. Oh. Sorry, kid. I don't have time to chat right I'm now. I'm a visitor. If you need someone to talk to, give Cunningham a try. You'll run into him eventually if you just keep moving. This can't be happening, man. This is not a good thing. I ran out of killer man, guys. He's thrusting, though. He is upset because he lost the killer man costume. Okay. Who do we have here? Um, excuse me, but someone got killed in the monitor room. They told me to come here and report to- You must be one of those part-timers. I'm Cunningham. I'm the supervisor of the killer man in enemy section 5. I'll be right with you. We need to go over employee rules and what work you'll be required to do. Oh, this is Reporter Yorg. He is here to check out our amusement park and actually write an exclusive article for us. Nice to meet you. Uh, you too. First, you've got to remember the basic duties. There's the park facility control room. Bro, when I'm a, I'm a visitor. Room, Chief, you're not gonna believe what happened. Oh. What is it? One of the Killer Man costumes is missing. What's the big deal? I'm sure one of you guys left it somewhere in the room. Don't lose your cool. Just take your time and look for it. It'll show up soon. But what if it doesn't show up? There's no way we can just ignore this thing, you know. Each costume costs 20 million dollars. 20 million? As you can see, this isn't a good time, as I've got guests at the moment. We can talk about this later if you don't mind. Oh, and as for you, I'll go over the instructions with you later on. While you're waiting, why not visit the park facility control room? Don't forget the ID card. I guess I'd better tell you where to find it. Take a look by the exit. It'll be right there. Why is everything overpriced? Well, you're sorry for the interruption. <laughs> Shall we continue? Let me show you our monitor room. This way, please. Why, indeed. Yeah, so... This level and the next one are both narrative. Start looking around backstage. But this one more so, I guess. So, I think I said this in the previous level, I said the next level is gonna uh, get a lot of reactions. But I think I was, I was talking about the next level, not this one. I forgot that this one was a thing. So, I guess you join them? Or, no. You haven't got your ID card yet, have you? I haven't seen this cutscene before. Go get one in the park facility control room. Huh. So if I remember right, there's either no traps in this map either, or they're not like, common. You're a tourist. Of course it's all overpriced. That is very true. <laughs> oh! Item sensor? Sick. <laughs> Don't think we missed anything here. No. Did any of you got, uh, well, maybe, maybe not, got scammed outright, but, um, close to it, I guess, when you visited some country? We kind of did, uh, or they did try to rip us off when we, uh, 
went to Turkey a few times. I'm still struggling to understand what is going on in this game. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a horror-themed park. At first, we were trying to save our friends, but now we're kind of rolling with it. Might as well stick um, around to get that hundred million. Oh, this is the only functioning one for some reason. But yeah, I guess the point here is to show you, like, oh, they also have the, uh, the photo boots. This is the backstage after all. Or, dare I say, the back rooms of El Bleed. So I think there is traps here. I have a lot of adrenaline, goddamn. Wait! I just realized I forgot to visit the shop. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, where was my last save? No. Gonna have to restart the game. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. <laughs> but uh, most of what we've seen so far is just cutscenes. We can get through this quick. Okay. When you were in Turkey, did you come across an ice cream man? No. I don't think so. Why? Wait a... Okay, this was not far away. Or too far away. Let's just finish this level and get it over with. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <sighs> hey, hurry up! <sighs> okay. So... Okay. Was there anything else? Oh. Turkish ice cream men are famous for trolling people. This the oh wait, I think I've seen the video you're talking about. Right. kind of scam we got into, or well, they tried to get us into was, uh, I think, one that I remember is with, like, a uh, coat. Some guy was, like, advertising this coat for, like, oh, discount, cheap price, but in reality, it wasn't really discounted. If anything, it was overpriced. <clears throat> okay. I think for some reason you can hit yourself here. Okay. Okay. Thankfully that didn't take too long. I'm glad I saved stated. That actually saved us. So we just have to get the upgrades, and then get the items, and we're set. Okay. That's the last one for this, and then a lot of bleed upgrades.
And boom. Oh my god. <laughs> A little too fast. Okay, here we go. So I can basically just buy a shit ton of heals now. One, two, three, four, five. I think like even for the remaining upgrades, I'm not gonna need all of this money. And I'm still gonna get, like, more money soon, so... Um... But yeah, I shouldn't waste a lot because, you know, the items vanish after you finish a level. But yeah, I think this is good enough. <laughs> I'm stacked. Yeah, it's like stocking up on healing items in Yakuza. Except in Yakuza, they don't disappear. <clears throat> Unless you're playing on PC, actually. Do you guys remember that glitch? Where if you open... Um, if you open the inventory sometimes, randomly, uh, your all of your heals get swapped for, like, something useless. You can't... Like, it's not even a heal, just an item. Okay. Another safe state, just in case. Oh wait, wrong movie. Oh, there it is. How expensive are things in Bahrain? The currency there has a good value. Uh, honestly, like, I'm not too sure because I barely look up, like, you know, the economies of other countries, so... The problem here is, usually the pay is, uh, like, it, it could be decent, but sometimes it doesn't feel enough. These are long hallways. <laughs> okay, the horror monitor. And boom. This turbo feature is actually going to be really helpful here because uh, there's a lot of areas in this level in particular where it's just like a straight hallway. Like it's just very long for no reason. There's this guy again. And here we go. Okay, now we're basically back to it. Uh, there was an item here, I think? There we go, the item sensor. Okay. Now we can save here and continue... ...like we should have early, early um earlier. Stream elements, you're a little late, don't you think? Damn it. Okay. Should probably be the same thing here. Yep, okay. Cool. Hmm. That a few times actually. I'm not even surprised. <laughs> God damn it. Not even bots do their job these days. We truly live in a society. Wait, what? Cool. 
Damn. Cool. Oh god, not this guy. Let's try to kill him, actually. Ooh. The axe is doing work. No, I didn't mean to walk, goddammit. What do you get for finding out these traps? Uh, you get your adrenaline back and, well, you know, if you prevent traps, you don't take the damage they deal to you. And bleed, potentially. And the heartbeat rising, which is all bad. And I think, you know, in the end as well, the more traps you get, the more money you get, basically. God, can this guy... There we go, finally. Cool. So here we go, a bit of an adrenaline replenish. <clears throat> hmm. I think I actually went past the few traps, which is good. Eggs! <laughs> okay. Enemy design, here we go. No! Never thought I would fight eggs. Meat! <sighs> Definition of balls out, yeah. <laughs> huh. Interesting spot. So, wait... What? I got no info on that. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yo, where's the body? It's gone. Amazon, let's go. Actually kind of worth it. Now I think there's something around here. Oh, it's the golem thing. Things. Over here, boys. Hey, hurry up! <laughs> the friendly fire. <laughs> wow. Hmm. Wait, where the? Oh. Okay.
they steal money. <laughs> wow. Never knew aliens wanted money, but... What? All right, the heartbeat. I might use the Amazon after this. Or maybe not, I'm not sure. Stabby stab. Okay, I'm definitely using it after this. Just die! Bruh! She's tanky! Oh my god, die! No! Oh my god. When was the last... Oh my god. I think I saved inside. So let me restart the game. God. She's so fucking tanky. Imagine if I'm wrong about this and he can actually use heals in the middle of the fight. To my knowledge, you can't. <clears throat> yeah, the doll wanted revenge. Okay. So there should be a trap here. We don't even need to worry about the adrenaline anymore. Right, I think there was an encounter here for an item. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bruh! Sheesh. Yeah, you know what? Let me just... I want to run away, but I feel like in this small of a space, I'm definitely going to get damaged anyway. Might as well just run, <laughs> stick to it. There we go. I need to save state more often. Gonna mark everything. One of the combat systems of all time, yeah. Hey, hurry up! Okay, the eggs are kind of easier to get past. Hey, <laughs> I'm gonna go back for that Amazon again. It's worth it. Okay, one of these was a trap last time. Yeah, 
And it is again. I might just get the Amazon and actually just go back. The bio body or whatever it is, I don't think it's really worth it. Oh, I forgot about this one. Okay. There we go. I might use a heal just for that Mary fight. And then sometime later, I'll, I'll I'll save the Amazon for later, probably. There we go. That was the problem last time. And the heartbeat as well, but... I think it's slower than last time now. One of these UFOs was a problem. I think it was on the right side. Actually, wait. I forgot that uh, Mark in it gets your adrenaline, so I went back for it. And... Okay, here we go. I might try to run away from her this time. So she starts off slow, and only like when you attack her, she gets into that flying fast phase. I noticed her doing it before too. Almost. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> They're still after the money? I'm out of Cashman's shop. Okay, I need to do something for the heartbeat and the bleed. Um Should be all good. Might as well save state, actually. This is a good place for that. Okay. Hmm. There's a sp Oh, there's an item here. Guess I'll go. Oh. That's not the jump button. Okay. There's an encounter, I guess. <laughs> oh, that range. God damn. Should be good now, come on. Okay, nice. Oh, we have a couple of stuff here. Another encounter? Check if there's an item around here. No. <clears throat> okay. Shotgun! Let's go. Um, and if you're wondering, yes, this is also infinite. <clears throat> ID card. I guess we use it here, too. Oh, you need to just use it at the door. <clears throat> Excuse me. There we go. <clears throat> oh, have the let's go emote? Never even... Completely forgot that. Okay, we have two places. Mm. 
Oh, this is back here. <clears throat> Pepe hands. Me when I think about the month that's remaining for Gaiden. When I came back. Oh, I think I know where I need to go, actually. But let me just say first. So the guy that was standing at the door over there is not there anymore. Guess we just go back to the same room we found the murdered guy. <clears throat> Me when Gaiden on Game Pass feels good, man. Yeah. How much is Game Pass now? Like a month? This is open now. Yorg! You are right about the body. This is a homicide case. Somebody killed him. You should have seen Manager Cunningham's face. He turned deathly white and rushed over to the main office. But never mind about him. Here, come take a look at this. It's a killer star. That's the mark of a killer man. This logo suggests that a killer man is actually the murderer. But here's the catch. Killer Man doesn't really exist. He's a fictional character they created for this theme park. It's hard to believe this could happen, but we have a real dead body here with a killer mark on it. All we have to do now is figure out what it all means. So, educate me, because I'm actually not sure. Game Pass started as an Xbox thing, right? And now it's on PC. Can you play all of those games on PC? Yorg is carefully examining Scott's body. So I think you need to go back... ...to this area. <laughs> oh, who do we have here? Jason? Yorg, come look at him! Look! Wait, she called him from all the way over here? Bruh! <laughs> Manager Cunningham. And look, another killer star. Cunningham was shouting out the names Killer Man and Jason. I wonder if the murderer is Jason. I see, Marcelo. I don't know about that. Yes, Eric. If Jason is the murderer, then... Why would he bother reporting to Cunningham about a missing killer man's costume? Well, I don't think a murderer would report the costume as missing, especially if he was going to wear the thing. Wow, Yorg. You sound like Lieutenant Colombo or something. Me? Oh, come on. You think so? Anyway, I wonder... <laughs> oh, come on. You think so? ...why killer killing one worker after another. The first thing we should do is find Jason. I just saw Jason heading toward the backyard a couple of minutes ago. The backyard? But that place is restricted to authorized personnel only. We can't get in there. There we go. Zero A24. Now we can get in. <clears throat> you can't stand his baby face? Oh, come on. Look at his face. What did he do to you? <laughs> oh. Damn. Yo, EBT. Hell yeah. 
seen this game multiple times, and it's so freaking hilarious. I love it. Cool. Sheesh, killed him already. <laughs> oh, the sound effects, dude. I love it. Man, the sound design for this game is actually so good. Even, you know, when it comes to the meme ones, which are there on purpose. <laughs> what? Uh oh! Bugs! Go again. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> She's not even a full body. The other guy was. Was still intact. Oh, by the way, check this out. Very Dengar. Dead. <laughs> Abandoning a carcass. I have no idea what this is. Yo, Groovy. Hell yeah. I barely got a chance. That guy is from uh, Blue Stinger, for those who know that game. That's a direct reference. Okay, where the hell... This reminded me of Tom and Jerry while Tom's being pummeled off screen. Exactly. God, I love those. <laughs> yeah, that was another Blue Stinger reference earlier. Hmm. Oh my... You actually gotta walk sometimes. Where are those going? I don't know if I want to know. Let me take something for the heartbeats. Yeah, I think I heard about that too, Groovy. That is pretty cool. Oh look, this time they got it right. Danger. High voltage. There's a song by that name. Danger, danger. Uh-oh. Whoa! That's the killer man. Look at the way he jumped. You know, I remember reading that Jason used to be a professional gymnast. <laughs> so it makes sense that he could pull off these killer man stunts. I don't so know, does man. That make Jason the murderer? That was a pretty ridiculous no, jump. What right do you guys think? Conclusions. There's not enough evidence to prove anything yet. A gymnast pulling off a jump like that? Oh, stream element, please. I want a physical copy of that game. Yeah, I heard that game is also like a cheesy ride like this one. Oh, 
I think there's no more traps from here on, I could be wrong. that Jason may be a former athlete but no human should be able to pull that kind of thing off not even a pro athlete not even a pro athlete there is actually a real killer man <laughs> no way that's impossible I bet he used some strong wire or powerful springs like a magician yeah that must be it Illbleed has a lot of tricksters and special effects artists not even a gymnast can pull that out fellas a pro athlete rather <laughs> Man, this game is so awesome. Yo, smile and missile. Hell yeah, I'm glad to see more Elblade enjoyers. <laughs> yeah, we are Scooby -Doo doing right now, actually. This uh, level is pretty unique. I think there's an Amazon in there. I meant to jump. There we go. Amazon, baby! So I think the next scene... No, maybe not the next one. Hold on. There's an item over there. Honestly, I don't even think I need items anymore. Like, I'm so loaded. But, hey. Artificial brain. Jason! Uh -huh. Stop right there. Jason. So you're the killer after all. No, no, it's not me. Uh, I, I Jason? can prove it. Here, the costume reeks of Cunningham sweat. And there's what? more. There's no sensor on it anymore. It's been ripped off the costume. Sensor? We used to have trouble with our workers stealing money or valuables from park visitors. So the management attached a sensor to the costumes to be able to track the thieves. But Cunningham's costume has no sensor. This means Cunningham has been... <laughs> oh! oh. Ah! <laughs> okay. Hey, guy, are you okay? Hang on there, buddy. We'll get some help. Hang on, buddy. Meanwhile, what were you trying to tell me about Cunningham? <sighs> that killer man just now was no ordinary guy. He had a strange move. And I wonder what Jason was about to tell me. Could it be that killer man is Cunningham? Then who was that dead body I saw? I'm going after that killer man. There's no time to lose. <laughs> Hey, guy, are you okay? <laughs> oh my god. By the way, did you pay attention to the part where he says, This suit reeks of Cunningham sweat. Like, wait, what? How do you know how Cunningham sweat smells like? Um, Sussy. The bullet missed the fatal spot. He seems to have survived. Sick. <sighs> this game, I'm telling you. The voice, dude. The, the voice acting in this game is just... Epic, if I do say so myself. Resident Evil time. What? No! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Bruh. Why do I start facing the ladder? Okay. Hmm. Oh boy, that's a long hallway too. Okay, so... Now... Uh, we're on for six hours now. Uh, 
Okay, so I think this is the next scene that I was talking about earlier. Wait a minute. Oh, this is... No, don't tell me. I think I'm not supposed to come here, actually. Pre-ordered eight, gotta wait like a hundred days, yep. Welcome to the gang. Yo, depressed Shinji, hell yeah. <laughs> okay, I need to make a safe state when I get to that part again. There we go. Man, they want to extend this level so much, they have you drop on a spot which basically forces you to come back. Uh, okay, so... save... and... Or wait... Now maybe I just... Hold on. Wait, what? Maybe I, I'm just supposed to go back? I actually don't remember, hold on. Because there's no other place to go to. So yeah, maybe I am just supposed to go back. going on the body it's gone Cunningham's body is gone I thought so your theory was right well yeah yeah Cunningham has been killing the workers for some unexplainable reason not only that he tried to finger Jason for the murders and cover he up tried to do what just when Jason was trying to tell me something pertinent to the crimes Cunningham murdered him in cold blood, right in front of me. Way to go, Yord. It's nothing. Much. Much. <laughs> well, what are we supposed to do now? We have to nail Cunningham. He must still be lurking somewhere nearby. Danger. Keep out, staff only. Okay, Cunningham. We're coming for your ass. Who would done it? Gather the clues you need. We're going to challenge your ability to solve the murder case. Try and use your clues to solve who the murderer is. If you come up with the right killer, you'll get a game cash bonus after clearing this stage. So who do you think the serial killer is? Come on, you can figure it out. Can you? So, we have some very interesting options here, okay? Now... Jorg, reporter for amusement, topic magazine, researching Illbleed. Jason, killer man, section staff, used to be a gymnast. <laughs> killer man, section chief, hot-headed and disturbed. And watch this one. You, abnormality must have led you to buy this game. Killer man is killer man. Ill bleeds enemy, mysterious murderer. So, which one is it, guys? So, th this says you, the player, not Eriko. You can't pick Eriko, actually. I don't think. Killer man is killer man. Or maybe it's Jason, you know, you never know. Maybe it's Yorg, Cunningham, or <laughs> maybe it's me, after all. I'm gonna do something another streamer did. Just for, like, suspense. I'm gonna hide the choice. The right choice. By the way, if you pick the right one, you get a million dollars. Not kidding. So you basically won't need money ever again. But then there's only, like, one level left, so... 
And if you get the wrong option, you miss out on that million. Please continue to play now. We hope you enjoy the music. Experience. Same smile. <laughs> Okay, well, uh, let's follow Cunningham, shall we? We gotta question him for fingering, uh, Jason. The morgue. So here's something interesting about the plot. Who? What died in here? Just about everything, duh. It's a duh. morgue, silly. A morgue? Yeah, where they keep the stiffs. Illbleed is full of dead bodies. More than a hundred visitors die in this park every day. Every day? Where the bodies get burned <laughs> and forgotten. Not exactly the high point of the park. This is really weird. It feels like spirits are swirling around my body. I hear ya. It's like a cold mist. So, up until now, we've kind of been, you know, kind of uncertain about whether or not this is all actually happening, you know, with the blood the killing and all that but apparently it's real so uh, uh like <laughs> i don't know like uh there's an item there there's a lot of items but yeah look at how long this place is just ridiculous so i'm definitely gonna use turbo Oh, I thought that was the item. Where's the item? Isn't your get dev on the game? He's a journalist looking into Illbleed. Close enough. <clears throat> Daigo with a gun is undefeatable. This is Silent Hill if it was based, yeah. <laughs> So, you could easily get lost in this game. Deep breath. Wait, Yorg is a dev on the game and his face was... Really? Okay, damn. That's pretty cool. So, I'm actually not sure if we should go down here. That's really cool, I never knew. So I guess we have to go... Look at how long this is, god damn. So I guess we can just go down from here. This is Silent Hill 3 if they made a full-on uh, game out of the amusement park section. True. Man, this game is crazy in a lot of ways. Okay. Man, look. Oh, my God. Sheesh. Sheesh. Wait, did I? I didn't come from here, did I? Don't think so, no. I hope this is the right place. I think it is. Yep. So these are supposed to be actual zombies, I think. Like, not costumes. Since, you know, remember, this is a level where, uh... Hey, hurry up! Hey, hurry up! Uh... It, like, everything is actually happening, and it's not, not not just the attraction. And I heard that you can't kill them, so... What was that? I don't think those were costumes. Those creeps were real. Hey! So, here's the thing about what just happened. If you don't find York, you're not gonna get the million dollars, 
and you will also get the bad ending, even though you saved all of your friends and Yorg is like, you know, someone you just met. So, we are gonna try to save him. He be- like, uh, he becomes a playable character, actually. But it's only for, like, for the, for the last level, so... So... Was it through here? Let's go down the route. Hey! Um... here. Probably gonna have to go back up again. So, wait. Uh, keep going there. Maybe all the way over there, but I could be wrong. Or wait, did I... So this is the part where it gets confusing. The the place you need to go to save him is kind of hard to get to. I mean, look at the size of this place. And it's a very specific spot. Uh, this place is huge. Okay, so probably is here. I hope it is here. Is it gonna be daily horror streams? That's the plan. I hope to uh, actually do that. Wait. Yeah, I can't go up here. That's the plan. We'll try to stick to it. I already have something for tomorrow. Or well, after tomorrow maximum. And it's gonna be epic. So wait, I thought there was a hole somewhere here. Do you have enough horror games planned, or are you looking for suggestions? Any Anyone that wants to suggest something, please feel free to. I've gotten a lot of them, but, you know, I'm always open. Uh... Deadly Premonition, yeah, someone suggested that too. Are you planning on doing another Amun Observation Duty? We could, if you guys want. I think chat enjoyed that one, because th that's one game where it's not just me playing. You guys could technically also play it. Carrier. I think I heard about that one. Yeah, Observation Duty is really good. Make sure some of the games are short. Yeah, don't worry. I think the next time is gonna be short on the shorter side. Probably four hours maximum, but we'll see. But it's also gonna be very entertaining. <laughs> I'll have to wait and see what I mean on that one. What's the plot of this game? You have to save your friends in a spooky amusement park. But then a lot of things happen. I keep going back in circles. Maybe, um... Wait... Maybe I'm supposed to continue a little bit from where, um, I... Uh, lost, uh, Yorg. Fatal frame. Uh, we'll see. Uh, you guys can just keep suggesting stuff. Wait a minute.
Imagine if I did this without turbo mode. Like, no kidding, all of this would probably extend to, like... 15 minutes? By now? Wait a minute. Minecraft Herobrine. Hell yeah. Top-notch horror. Okay, so just in case, I will make a save here. Sound Mind PT. I would have to pull out the PlayStation and make a mess near the computer. A big mess. Hmm. Parasite Eve 1 and 2. Yeah, that could be something we play. Well, I mean, we'll see. I'm getting a lot of suggestions and, you know, Whoa, okay, that was a scare. I don't think we're gonna be able to play everything realistically, but... We'll see. What do you think of the Resident Evil Revelations games? Pretty good games, but I think one is way better. Killer 7. I don't know. Oh, this this place is big. God damn. So, wait. Mm. Yeah, thank God for the speed up mode. Look at this place. <laughs> Legs must be hurting with those heels. Ah, uh, it's Erico. She's a beast. Uh, Chilla's Art announced something in the beginning of September that they're working on. Right, yeah, maybe we could do more Chilla's Art stuff. Oh my god, this place. <laughs> Imagine going all the way over here without Turbo. Look at this. That takes a few seconds with Turbo. So, wait. Do you have any Scientology games on the list? Yes, I wanted to play Origins and Shattered Memories. I never played Shattered Memories, so that's gonna be new for me. And then Origins, it's been a while, never played it on the channel. Wait, there's something. Bandage. I did hear about Kamiya. Yeah, yeah. Maybe. Yeah, this is probably not it. Hmm. Hold on, let me look up the map for this. I want to save him if we want the good ending. Hold on, Ill Bleed. Um, how to find Yorg. Um, Alan Wake. Yeah, I heard about... I I've been told about Alan Wake by a friend as well. Um, never got around to playing it, though. Uh... So wait, after you say- no wait, that's not it. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Uh, 
Huh, this is kind of confusing. On the railing. Wait. Once you get to point B. Oh my god, <laughs> this map. <laughs> okay. I think I, I'm gonna have to uh, load this. So. Can we zoom out? I guess not. Um, bio body. Oh, wait. Bio body. Hmm. So wait, I think I do need to continue from here. Continue forward up. Keep following a path. A ledge that you can jump off to onto the car trucks. So the next place we can jump off of Uh, yes, I do like Devil May Cry. I might play the first one. We'll see, though. Man, I really wish, like a lot of these games that I love, I kind of wish how I... I wish I knew how to kind of... where to exactly go and all that so I can beat them in one stream. So, wait. But I think I see the, the thing at last. No. Okay, no, wait, I do, I do. Onimusha, that's another thing that I've been wanting to... No, god damn it. Yeah, we'll see, we'll see. Um, if you have any suggestions, drop them in the chat. And we'll see what we get around to playing. And if your game doesn't get picked... Don't... No hard feelings. There's a lot of games to go through. <laughs> Almost fell off again. Okay, so, there's... An item here. Wait, no. Man, this map is actually so confusing. <laughs> the things we go through to save these characters. So hold on. Uh, uh, hmm. I think this was a dead end. Yeah. Almost jumped. Wait, the bandage was here, right? Hold on. Okay, so the bandage is here. Point B. Jump off the tracks, and now we have another set of stairs. Okay, so we could go here. Wait, did I miss an item? Oh, has he? Okay. So, a large diagram. There we go. So to save York, we want to go here, apparently. Hold on, let me save state. 
The floor looks like coffee beans to me. It's bodies. Okay, so... Question is, do we jump off of here? So, wait... I guess we have to jump down. Yeah, a lot of old games can be really cryptic. Oh god, speaking of cryptic, Martian Gothic. Oh my god, that game. One of the most, like, actually, I think it's impossible to beat that game without a guide. Like, man, I... Yeah, I'm using fast forward. Because look at these hallways. That's not it. Oh. Oh, I think we got it. Yorg! We got him! Good ending time. <clears throat> Thank you. You saved my life. And I am grateful, even though it's kind of embarrassing to get caught off guard like that. Rescued. He's a playable character. Okay. So, now we need to find the proper way forward. Now I think... Yep, there we go. This should be it. <laughs> Look at these hallways. Or, well, hallway. Oh, I think I should drop down that... Uh... Opening. Okay, just in case. <clears throat> okay. Uh, there's an item behind us. You need a whole plane for this place, yeah. <laughs> when I said earlier, like, there's some stages where, like, you have to... Like, <laughs> just... Like, it gets really confusing. Yeah, this is what I mean. Imagine playing this for the first time without a guide or anything like that. Oh shit! Zombies! No helipad? Oh, there, there we go. Hey, hurry up! There's the plane. Well, not the plane, but the helicopter. Better than nothing, I guess. What? <laughs> okay, let me take them away again. What about the shotgun? The thing is, you can't kill these guys, to my knowledge. Am I supposed to go the opposite way? <laughs> the most silent shotgun ever, yeah. <sighs> All 
Are you gonna go for the ending where Eriko is almost naked? Nah. That's that's a new game plus, right? Yeah, we're definitely not going for new game plus. Once is enough for this game. Oh, is this it? Or maybe not. Bruh, I'm so confused. <laughs> this place. Oh, this, wait, no, this is this is where we went initially. So we go here. Wait, so... What? Yeah, the true ending of this game is pretty weird. And that's saying something, because the... normal playthrough of this game... is, uh... pretty weird on its own. And trust me, you might think you've seen most of what the game has to offer so far, but the next level is, um, you'll see. I think this is it. Oh god, finally. <laughs> finally, we got through it. Okay, so... Dead fresh. Mm -mm -mm. Fresh dead people. Now, what do we have here? Get a load of that! Jason was right. But why would he kill workers who don't have any award money? Well, uh, that's because... Mm, mm. Aren't you a detective? <laughs> Stop that? arguing. I hear you. Uh -oh. Come out with your hands up. Not the cutscene gun. So, it's you guys, you dirty rats. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I see. You're here to get my money. <laughs> no, you can't do this. <laughs> There's 50,000 dead bodies here. What's a few more bodies? Nothing like being part of a crowd, eh? <laughs> I was please, a PS2 guy. Please don't shoot me. Don't waste your breath, buddy. Nothing phases me. <laughs> <laughs> Killer man. Uh oh. Holy shit. Okay, hold on. Just in case, I'm gonna use a save state here. Because I actually still don't know how to use my uh, heals during fights. Oh my god. Stop teleporting. <laughs> oh, you're gonna get the explanation, don't worry. I should probably be close then. Whoa! The 360!
<laughs> shrugs and dies. Bruh. Oh, I guess I should die. Scott, Jeff, Martin. These workers were all killed by the spirits of dead visitors. They possess the killer man's body and use him to carry out the kills. Except for the second murder of Cunningham. Cunningham tried to frame Jason for the deed so he could grab the award money when no one was looking. Unfortunately, Jason discovered Cunningham's killer man costume with its sensor removed. So, you could play the pursuit theme from Ace Attorney here. Who managed to survive the attack? That explains why Jason's attacker moved differently and used a different weapon than the other killer man spirits. It was Cunningham in the killer man disguise. The tables were turned when the spirits of the dead visitors got the best of the impersonator. Ill bleed. What a scary place. But what is more scary is how a human soul can be so full of hate and anger. As that face twitches. Like <laughs> is this what you're going to write your article about? Yes, if I can make it home alive. The headline will be... Revealed the real culprits behind a homicidal theme park. I see. What's wrong? Mm, nothing. Okay. Ah, this mysterious theme park, Illbleed. Our investigation is almost over. The Michael Reynolds Museum is nearby. Let's go. You know what Randy says here? He has different dialogue. He asks Jorg, am I gonna be in the article? And then York says, yeah, sure. And then he's like, yeah, cool! Okay, let's see. The person you chose as murderer was... Killer Man! Killer Man was possessed by the souls of past challengers to seek revenge for their death. Your reasoning is correct. You get prize money. A million dollars! I'm rich. <laughs> so Killer Man is Killer Man. And then the 50,000. Basically chump change. <laughs> God, this game. Okay, I think I can only get like one upgrade, but you know, let's get it. I miss the dialogue. Was the stage really real? Yes. As real as it could get. I think there's nothing more I can get for Erica. Oh, wait. Yes, there is. And that's it. <laughs> okay. God, I can buy the whole freaking store for the next level now. Which I probably will. Da, 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 da. Right. <laughs> Something tells me I'll be fine in the next level. The porn is literally useless, you don't want it. It brings you closer to death. Okay. Are you sure about that? Okay, you guys are gonna love the next level. If you think you've seen the worst, the goofiest this game has to offer, <laughs> oh. oh, you might want to stick around for this. This is actually gonna be a life-changing experience. Um, in the best way possible. 
So, the last level. Toy Hunter! Pork Goes to Hell. Starring Enda with Sexy Doll, Mary Doll, Hotedon. Directed by Michael Reynolds. Screenplay Michael Reynolds. Produced by Michael Reynolds. Alright, so, uh, gonna take a small break. You guys grab like a snack or popcorn or water or something. This is gonna be a right, trust me. <laughs> Or are we jamming? Which one of the two? Okay. <sighs> no, so this is technically the last level. There's a very small tidbit after it, but it's not really a level. So this is the last level. Um, what's remaining is basically the final boss, if you want to call it that. That's really it. But yeah, um, if you're here, this is gonna be... One of the experiences of all time. And oh boy, you'll see it. Okay. <clears throat> You know, given how everything is structured, I guess I'll actually talk about it later, if I remember. But basically, this was supposed to be the level before the last. The Killer Man level, I think there's hints in this uh, level that kind of, you know, refer to it as the last level, but it's not. I guess they changed it in development. But anyway, Toy Hunter. The popular series Toy Hunter is now a fun attraction. It's based Does that ass look familiar? Cork goes to hell that's not yet released. In other words, in this attraction you'll be able to find out what happens in the new episode of Toy Hunter before anyone else. In the last episode, our hero, Cork the Toy Hunter, had defeated the Cactus Man of Mexico and no one had seen him since. The Cactus Man of Mexico. <laughs> ends where Cork returns home for the first time in three years after a long journey. His home is a toy box full of fun things. There, mm, Cork fun was things. reunited with his fellow toys. He thought he could go back to living peacefully as his owner Henry's favorite doll. But that was not to be. Something unbelievable happens to Henry. As a result, strange things happen around Cork. Cork's new adventure is about to begin. 
Yeah, the cactus picture is so good. <laughs> And like that. This attraction is a cactus has the hat with a smile. Accurately reproduces this new story. Cork goes to hell. Here you'll assume the role of Cork and make your way to the end while fighting against horrible enemies. This attraction is not something that you merely sit and watch. The characters that appear and the settings in this story are all real. So if the enemies get you, you will die. So come and enjoy Toy Hunter, as if your life depended on it. You will die. So come and enjoy. <laughs> Toy Hunter, the attraction. <clears throat> Okay, you guys ready? To the challengers. What kind of story and ending is awaiting for us in the new Toy Hunter? And what is the object of this work given to us? Three hundred thousand. Okay. Horror monitor. Let's get a ticket. Whoa! Rude. Okay, we don't need to suffer already. Might be easier to actually kill him. Uh oh. Oh, that didn't hit somehow? Huh. Oh, what? Okay. Let's get the ticket. You cannot enter without a ticket. Say less, buddy. Say less. Look. now let's go howdy boys and girls isn't oh. it fun to be me yeah i'm having fun too now i'm gonna tell you how to play the game so listen carefully you're about to enjoy toy hunter's new story cork goes to hell okay well i know you have no idea what the story is about and don't think you can learn as you go now uh uh why well before i get into that it'd be a good idea to check out this here horror monitor we I'm know sure that you already know what that blinking light is right yep it means a weapon is hidden then, how about this? Oh, it's a story now. This is called a story mark. What does this mean? Well, doesn't take a brain surgeon to figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Whenever this story mark shows up, 
That means the story is hidden at the spot. Now try to get close to the place which indicates the story mark. Some kind of event will happen and parts of stories will be revealed to you. But be careful. Some events out there can harm you. In other words, you have to bet your life to get to know the story. If you're almost dead and too weak to get more of the story, use cautious action and do what you can to avoid the event. Cautious action? The drawback action. to that is you won't uncover the entire story. Also, have you noticed that one of the stage's conditions has changed from traps cleared to story? This is when you'll receive a monetary reward. Monetary reward. You saw, not how many traps you cleared. I love his accent. <laughs> remember this, and you won't get confused. Hey, what do you think of these settings? Do you like it? Cool. By the way, if you'd like to see the instructions again, I wrote them down and put them on the ticket booth where they're yours for the taking. Okay. Good luck, boys and girls. If you're a real cork like me, you can get through anything, no problem. Yeehaw! Can we get a cowboy emoji in chat? Yeehaw! Yeehaw! Yeah! Let's go. <laughs> Alright, we're a cowboy now. Cork. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this basically becomes a different game with this level. Alright. Yo, is that a story over there? <laughs> yep. Huh, wait, what? Wait. I think I'm missing a cutscene. Wait. <laughs> I am immortal. I remember her? Hey, what's wrong, Marie? Henry is in trouble? Who's Henry? Cork, did the trip to Mexico make you crazy? Henry is the boy who owns us. You know, the guy who's so nice oh, to us. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. So, well, what's the, um, Henry boy's problem, anyway? He's really sick. Oh. Oh. <sighs> huh. Wait, wait, wait. This is supposed to be a cutscene. I'm not joking. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. What? Oh, oh. Wait, no. No, that's not it. Oh! Uh, uh, I'm going to sleep. Good night, doll. Night, night, Marie. <laughs> oh, uh, sweet dreams, Cook. <laughs> okay, sweet dreams. Huh. <sighs> Wait, I think I bugged the game, actually. There's supposed to be a story with Sexy Doll. Lady. <laughs> no, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I think I bugged it out somehow. Wait. No way. How? Yeah, it does look like a different game. Was I not supposed to do this? Wait. Oh god, that's a bit far away. Let me restart the game. It's worth it. <laughs> There's a whole cutscene, actually. <clears throat> mm. 
I thought looking at story points is supposed to give you the cutscenes, not take them away. Yeehaw! Okay, just to check, I did buy the items, right? Yep. Remember to hydrate, guys. Yep. Yeah, it really does look like a different game. I'm afraid of what we're gonna see. Oh, why? Why so afraid? Just... <laughs> the story again, okay. Oh god, we need to fight this guy again. Okay. I'm gonna save it after I kill this guy. I meant to run away, not walk. Whoa, the jump. Ill Bleed invented the concept of shooting. Yeah, that's why it's so good. Let me put the ticket. I like that you can skip cutscenes. It's really good for this kind of game. What game is this? Um, Ill Bleed. Okay, skip. <laughs> okay, here we go. <clears throat> I'm gonna save before I jump down. Okay. Okay, maybe if I don't... Yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, sex a doll. <laughs> Welcome home, darling. How was Mexico? Oh, it was horrible. Oh, it was horrible. Tell me the story later. In bed, if oh. you dare. <laughs> TOS indeed. Okay, I'm gonna watch and skip this one. We saw it already. But I can't skip it. Huh. Oh! Oh! oh I'm going to sleep. Night, Wonder why I can't skip this one. Oh, uh, sweet dreams, Cork. Sweet dreams, Cork. Thank you, buddy. My mom is sitting next to me. Oh no, <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, if your mom is listening to this, please don't blame Grammy. This game is just different. It's built different. I am immortal. Yeah, I can't skip this one either, but that's fine. What's wrong, Marie? Hey, what's wrong, Marie? Henry is in trouble? Who's Henry? Cork, did the trip to Mexico make you crazy? He I literally forgot his owner. Us. You know, the guy who's so nice oh, to us? Oh, that's right, yeah, yeah. So, well, what's the, um, Henry boy's problem, anyway? I'm watching this on a 72-inch TV in the living room. Really? I mean, if there's no one around you, that's fine. Oh. oh! That's me when I think about oh. how infinite wealth is. Months away. Three months away. Oh! Okay. Oh! Uh, holy shit. <laughs> Holy. Oh! 
<laughs> uh. Oh, what? Yeah, that's me too, buddy. <sighs> okay, so... You guys are about to see another shocker. See all these books, like the way they're lining up here? You know, just normal books, right? There's even a Japanese one here. Now, if you go to the back side over here... What do we have here? <laughs> oh my god. Henry, what are you hiding here? God, the devs had a lot of fun with this. Oh, here's another banger. Henry, sleep in peace. Here's your favorite sexy doll. His mom is okay with this? <laughs> Cork, darling, I love you, but I guess this is our goodbye. No! Yeah, that that kid's mom is pretty chill. <sighs> Cork left the house when he lost his beloved lover, Sexy Doll. He wandered and wandered for days. He found himself walking toward the graveyard where Henry was buried. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> I think there's a trap around here, actually. Wait a minute. There we go. Cork's sounds are so funny. Okay, anything else in here? Okay, we're outside. It's raining! I don't think we even need items, so we can just push on. Yeah, Yakuza 8 demo with a dynamic weather change. Sight. Yep. Yes! Or is that a yep? I don't know. One of the two. Yep. So, uh, there is this thing. It actually does nothing, as far as I know. Like, you would think this is something, but I guess not. Yep! Yep! Whoa, the monkeys. <gasps> Cork is really good, actually, with the... the gun. Yo, the shooting! <laughs> nice. He's going in! Yep! yep. Yeah, from the hip, too. He's a certified cowboy. 
anything here. <laughs> Ichiban, if he made a horror game. <laughs> Keep popping in, and this game looks different each time. Yeah. <laughs> Cord, I will never forget the first time we had together. <gasps> Sexy doll. Sexy doll. I wanted to see you one last time. <laughs> this is Kiryu and you and me in another dimension. Sonic! Sorry, not Sonic. Demon Sonic. Oh my god. <laughs> well, well, well. <laughs> Woody versus Sonic. Isn't that epic? You were able to save the world from the attack of Cactus Man, but you cannot save Sexy Doll. Hey. <sighs> oh, he's already sad enough. Leave him. <sighs> hmm. Oh, shit. She called him hopeless, and that really hurt Gork deeply. All he could hear was that word hopeless, echoing over and over. Gork was so depressed, he really did lose hope. Instead of being a super toy hero, he turned into a worthless bum. Sheesh, not you too. Huh. <sighs> Ooh. Oh, it's the ladies. The gun ladies. Hey! Oh god, I can't run! Dude, they were blocking me. <laughs> there we go. Why do the Yakuza games have only one breed of dog 99% of the time? Too expensive to make another duck. Yep. Yep. <laughs> okay. Um, gonna heal. I need something with a heartbeat too. Yep. Mm. Oh. Okay, uh... Da, da, da. It's Sonic's hand again. Another encounter, probably? Oh, these guys, the Kung Fu guys. Oh, nice, the friendly fire. <laughs> That's not friendly fire. Hey! Yep. Is Erica inside Cork or something? Yes. Uh, so at the beginning, you know, you saw the worm, like, kind of swallowing Erico and then, uh, spitting out a cork. Yeah, that's what happened. Egg bar. Gonna get me some of that good egg.
milk. <laughs> you ever just want to drink a whole jug of milk? Cork does. Hey, I know. I know. All right, get your cat jams ready. Do you know the golden cord? Hey, I know this boy so well. He couldn't save his sexy dog. Hey, come on, not you guys too. <laughs> Now, what is Cork's reaction to this? No, shut up! My god, this game is gold. <laughs> No, I wanted to run, goddammit. Okay, we had a bit of friendly fire. This, you know, this whole episode or stage or movie, whatever you want to call it. It really feels like some kind of dark humor adult movie, which you will see more of soon. Uh, sorry, dark humor adult cartoon, I guess. Whatever. Look at the egg yolk coming out of them. The detail. <clears throat> yeah, Nagoshi himself gave me an early copy of this. Oh my god, this egg is tough. Oh, dude, die! Holy shit. <laughs> I wanted to run. Finally, there we go. Yep. yep. Alright. We killed a bunch of eggs at a bar. Uh oh. It's GTA time. Lock him up for 500 years. No, <laughs> the Indian the voice. <laughs> I hear you. I hear you. Uh, yeah, kill the bum and send him to hell. Roger that. Perfect. Yeah, cars before cars was a thing. Arrest. I am arrest. So you basically have no choice but to go here. The police station. It's right here. Alka Toys, by the way. <laughs> Look at it. Oh my god. I'm gonna save here. Alka Toys. My favorite prison. Sidemen should give it a visit. Egg murderer Cork. Go to cell number 577. You can walk yourself to your cell. Okay. Ah. Oh. Uh. Everything makes this man so sad. Yep. 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 Damn, people are vicious here. Oh, it's one of these. This is called a gourd, right? I wonder why they called it a gabooey. Maybe it's just the word, I don't know. Resident Evil Survivor vibes. Yeah. Ooh, a 
I'll take that. <clears throat> this looks like a weird kind of game you'd see your stoner friend sit and mindlessly play. Yeah. <laughs> Oh boy, this game. Yep. Yep. Another one of these. Felons. Danger. Oh god, this scene. It's judgment time. <laughs> Got the death penalty. <sighs> Do I have more traps here? Oh, shit. Oh, it's this guy. Remember him? What is he doing in toy jail? That's a question, isn't it? Here we go. This is my cell, I think. Whoa. <laughs> it's Buzz! Made in China. Hey, you! What are you doing over there? You came just in time. I tried to escape from this prison, but I ran out of gas. Hey! Aren't you Cork? Who couldn't save the sexy ball? Don't remind me. <sighs> Who is you? My name is Ponty Dog. I've been in prison for 19 years. 19 but years? First, buddy. Don't just stand there. Buy me some gasoline. Once I'm loose, I'll tell you a great story. Okay. Gals? Okay, sure. Okay, sure. <laughs> <sighs> Why does he keep sighing? Oh, I don't think I saw that in the other playthroughs. Hmm. Yeah, sure. Uh oh. Yep. Okay. Yeah, it's been a while. This is the last stage, though. Hopefully, uh. Whoa, what the? Hello? Infinite supply? What? Wait, no way. Or is that just a glitch that I discovered accidentally? Yeah, the maximum is nine, huh? Bruh, more? Okay. Another one of these? What? Okay. Hey, it's back to normal. What? Polkadon has run out of gas? Well, that is an emergency. Here! Take my gasoline to Polkadon. <sighs> is this gas in jail too? <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm gonna use the one bandage here. <clears throat> nice.
Hey, buddy. There we go. These devs had a fun time making this. Oh, for sure. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, what a relief. I thought it was a goner for sure. Thank you. You must have received a death sentence to have ended up here. Well, yeah. So, uh, what's your great story? Yes. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Well, how'd you like to hook up a game with Sexy Dog? Who's been kidnapped and taken to hell? Yo, Max. The best way to do that is by actually getting executed. <laughs> Easy. Huh? What are you talking about? According to the toy bible I read a long time ago. The toy you're bible. Go for sure if you're executed. <laughs> See? You mean I can rendezvous with sexy doll if I hang me? Yep, that's the deal. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! <laughs> Don't get too excited. Isn't it time for an execution? The toy bible. Okay. They have their own Bible. Oh. Yeehaw! Yeah, the way they just reused the same voice clip twice in a row. I guess I'm not supposed to go here. Hey. Hey. He looks like Indiana Jones and Woody, yeah. I think his name was supposed to be like Inda or something. Oh. Sheesh. Hey. <laughs> hey. Oh, there we go. Guess what, Cork? You're leaving Death Row. To be hung right now! Uh oh. Sexy doll, we'll be together again soon! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I made it just in time! <laughs> what the hell are you? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what was that for? I wanted to die! <sighs> this game. <clears throat> okay. Oh, Yakuza has nothing on this in terms of silliness. God damn. Like, how do you think of this story? I think I'm supposed to go further down, I guess. What is that, though? Oh, cool. <clears throat> I guess further up. Mm. 
Uh oh. I'll probably use something with a heartbeat. Let me, let me do that. <laughs> oh boy. I did that because I found out you shouldn't get executed after all. Why? After you left, I checked the toy Bible again, <laughs> and I realized I remembered it wrong. You see, the type of hell in which sexy doll is being held is called toy hell. Toy it's hell, a hell oh. Toys go through if the toys get buried in the grave along with the That daughter. makes sense. If you die in any other way, you just go to plain old hell, which is not what sexy doll is waiting for oh. you. That wouldn't have been Yeah, good. that was close, my friend. <laughs> if I'd shown up a minute later, you'd have died for nothing. <laughs> That'll teach me to listen to you. I will tell you another good story. Another lie? No, this really is a great one. This sewer tunnel leads to a town where humans live. But once you get there, find a kid who will be your owner and share a coffin together. Then you can go to toy hell. Isn't that a great plan? Trust me, this time it'll work out. <laughs> my hey, man just hit him with the stare. Before the wardens find us. Hop on my back, because it's kind of a long way to where the humans are. Ready? Here we go. <laughs> just looked at him like... Well, he would, like, not smile, but he can't. He's made like that. <laughs> Yeah! Oh. <laughs> oh no! Don't tell me I'm already out of gas. <laughs> oh. Sorry, Cork. I guess you'll have to walk the rest of the way down the tunnel. Remember. Yo, find Chris, a welcome. And find one who's near death. Oh no, I'm dizzy now. Hey, take the chip out from my body and take it with you. When you find the same kind of toy as me, just put this chip into it. Then you can see me again. <gasps> I think this is it for me. Go, Cork. You gotta go. No. Don't give up. Find the kid. <laughs> uh -huh. The chip. No, we've been through so much together. <laughs> Made in China again, bruh. Hey, you tired. Is he gonna sigh? No, bruh. Ladies and gentlemen, we lost the real one. Okay. Santa Claus comes. Santa Claus comes for the poor children who can't buy a toy for the present. Let's write a toy to want in the paper and put all in the bulletin board. Certainly, Santa Claus satisfies a wish. I love how you can tell that this was written by someone like... Um... What do they call it? ESL? What is this place? Why is there a mattress here? Um. What is this? 
to Santa Claus. The toy which needs me is the doll of Toy Hunter. Why? My house is the second floor of the apartment without making a mistake. Jeremy. Cork. <laughs> Bruh. The amount of detail for like a game of its time is just kind of insane. Is this a, supposed to be a horror game? It started out as one, yeah, but then it, it went places. <laughs> oh. Jerma, yeah. Caution. Recently, ghost and so on. <laughs> ghost and so on? Couldn't find space to name the others? Increase in this town. As for the children, to be careful. Man. I wonder if he can find stuff around here. He can. More mattresses. Wait, there's something. Oh, another one of those. Uh, let's just say you entered at the silliest level, uh, Chris. This level is, uh, something, alright? Okay, let's try escaping with Cork. See what he says. He said nothing this time, but he does have a line. <clears throat> uh... Okay, I don't think I'm supposed to go here. Let's see. I think that's where I'm supposed to go. Let's find out, I guess. <clears throat> what is this? Man, there's a lot of items scattered around. Just in case something happens, I'll save state again. Blackbird. Huh. Nothing here? Should be the right place. Oh. oh, it's the ladies again. Hey! Oh, damn. The gun slap. These remind me of the nurses from Silent Hill, just a little bit. Okay. Yep. When are you gonna end the stream? Once we finish the game. Yep. Hopefully, from, like, starting now, it shouldn't take more than an hour, but we'll see. Um, let's heal. Um... Can't wait for Silent Hill 2 Remake, same. I'm kinda sad they showed nothing at TGS. I think, like, Konami attended and they just showed the same, um... Uh, trailer they 
revealed before. Huh. Wait a minute, didn't I come from there? Yo, Velvet, how you doing? Wait a minute. Maybe I'm not supposed to be here. I think there's a specific place you need to go to. Like a... Well, I'll see if I can find it. But... Oh, here we go. We're supposed to look into windows, I guess. Our day of today, for some reason. I am pretty far into Ill Bleed now. This is near the end. Can we not look into this one? Whoa. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Wait, which window am I supposed to look into then? I guess we're looking for a broken window. And even then, not all of them work, I guess. The PC requirements. Um, were they actually clear with that, or is it kind of vague? Nobody seems to, uh, seems to live here. God, I can't remember which window it was. The specs are kind of demanding. What was the recommended card again? Was it uh, a Series 30 or...? It's definitely not here. 2080. Didn't... Wait, is that the minimum or the recommended? I think Starfield is uh, probably more demanding than that, if I remember right. Recommended, okay. Oh no, not the eggs again. Over here. Over here. Recommended 28 for medium settings is 60 FPS. Huh. Wait a minute. Oh, we can just read this, like that. So wait, second floor, it says. Maybe it's around here. Second floor... There we go. Yeah, it's Korg from Toy Hunter. This is cool. This is cool. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Korg. Damn. <laughs> right. Ouch. What a rough kid. Wait a minute. I got owned by a kid again. That means I could go to Toy Hill and meet my sexy doll. So about the specs, man, I'm so glad like uh, PC parts nowadays are like they're nowhere near as ex expensive as they used to be. Like what four plus years ago, they were like fucking insane. Now I think like the most budget friendly. Um, 
card is an RTX 3060, which is the one that I have actually. Pretty good value for the money. Same toy as Portadon. There we go. When he streamed this game, I didn't think it would have this much content. It's impressive. Oh, yes, it is. And to add to that, there's New Game Plus, and you can't get the true ending on the first playthrough. Uh, so that's cool. All right, there's the chip. Fellas, you might want to pay attention to this one. <laughs> we have him back! Hi! We meet again! Yes! Potadon! It's really you! You made it through the tunnel, Cork! I even found my new owner! Look at that kid! What the? That's not the kid I was talking about! He's healthy as hell! <laughs> you can't meet with Sexy Doll until you get buried in a coffin! Oh, yeah! You're right! Gosh, what would you do without me, hmm? <laughs> That's it! Now listen to his hey, plan. We can use this and shoot that kid. Catch! <laughs> oh. Are you serious? You're gonna use this? We're not gonna kill him for real. Just knock him unconscious with this. We're gonna make people think he's dead. Use this and shoot that kid. Now's the chance. Shoot him. Me? I'm the one to shoot him. Now's the chance. Shoot him. <laughs> the repetition of the line. <laughs> oh my god. Why does the kid have something like this anyway? Jeremy! His grandma noticed. There we go. Yeah, we did it. It's it a success. <laughs> we shot a kid. Hell yeah, let's go. Oh, this game, dude. <laughs> yeah, I heard about the 4060. It's like n really not good. Like you get more value with the 3060, as far as I heard. Oh my god. <laughs> My poor Jeremy. Oh, sleep in peace. Here, I'll put your favorite toy on the door with you. Whoa! Now we can reunite with Sexy Doll. <laughs> oh, yeah! I can meet my darling Sexy Doll at last! Yeah, I heard about as much. I just came on stream and the first thing I hear is I shot a kid. Yep, welcome to Illblade. Time to go to Toy Hill, I guess. Well, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna have a save state here. Would be a shame if we had to load all the way back from before. <laughs> Damn, look at this place. Wow. Wow. Hey. Hey. <laughs> There's Sonic. <laughs> Zodic? Zodic, it's his name. How oh, I missed you, honey. There she is. Don't come over here, darling. Sexy doll. <laughs> This monster makes short work of you. Oh, Zodic. Zodic, you cannot get away with this, you mother. Your mother? Yeah, tell him. Tell him, Cork. <laughs> oh. So, if it wasn't blatant enough that this actually is Sonic, watch this. 
Wait, aren't we saving our friends? Yes, we are. And this is still the same game. Okay, so I think we want him to... Uh, we want him to do the role. Look! <laughs> so you have to shoot his rings. That's how we actually damage him. So, yep. This is most definitely... Sonic. Or, should I say, Zodic. Oh my god. Sonic.exe before Sonic.exe, yep. Is this the last one? Alright. Ending time, kinda. really had to put that sound effect. Ah, dear sexy doll. Ah, dear sexy doll. Ooh. It's the control room. Zodic control room. What the hell? What's wrong? Didn't Gork win? <laughs> hmm. It's strange. What does Zodic strength gauge show? It's zero. What about the ring setting over there? Check if the damage count and parameters weren't misread. This is so meta. I'm checking now. This is not going well. Oh no! Look at that! The ring setting is on 80! What? You inputted the wrong settings, didn't you? <laughs> no! I, I swear I set it to 8! Whatever. Just set it back to normal. I can't! Until the player completely clears the setting, it can't be reset. You mean they have to battle nine more times? What's going on, darling? I have no idea, baby. Baby? It seems like they're having some trouble. Well, there's no choice. They must battle it out nine more times. Puppet combo. What? They're gonna die if they do that. Yeah, we'll what see about we puppet do? combo games. Ooh. Oh my god. Uh-oh. Why? Why? Hey, why are you stopping it? We can't do this to him. If the challenger's parameter hits zero during the battle, you don't know what's gonna happen. And if they get into an infinite loop, then we're really out of control. We won't know until we actually try it. You actually get a big piece of lore by listening to the two guys up there hey, soon. Cork. Wow, I see a lovely lady there by your side. <laughs> Does that mean you already knocked out Zodic? Well, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm not gonna get involved with this. You write the report Listen. later then. What do you mean? You're the one who made the mistake with the settings. No, I didn't. That's why I hate using a former wood puppet. You guys have no brain. Especially the ones who used to lay down on the belt conveyors. I remember when you were a monkey. You got all excited handling the horror monitor. Remember that? In the second stage? What do you mean, you blockhead? There was a monkey who, like, stole the horror monitor to look at us. Apparently one of them was that monkey. Probably controlling it or something, I don't know. What's going on here? I have no idea. Love how even these guys are confused. Good idea. Hey! Hold it on. Will you give us a ride? How'd I know that was coming? Well, okay. Let's get a move on. Here we go. <laughs> when we go back home, tell me you're a 
Avengers Day on our cuddly bed. If you like. Hmm? <laughs> oh, brother. That's about all the stocky stuff I can handle for you. Guys. I have no idea what he said, but he's the third wheel. <laughs> That was a level. What do we think? <laughs> Which one is the best one so far? Man, we're rich. End game. I wish I was rich in real life, but yeah. <clears throat> okay. Cherish the song. This is going to be the last time we hear it today. I don't think there's more upgrades that I can get. No, wait, there is one. Just one, though. How can so much awesomeness be fit into one disc? I know, right? <laughs> no, wait. Oh, maybe we really got everything. Yep. That was the most chaotic thing I saw all day. <laughs> Glad you guys are having fun. Okay, I should probably buy more stuff. So basically, the only thing that's left right now is one fight. So we're, we're pretty close to finishing now. We don't even need all of these, but you know. That song is a banger, yeah. I love it. Okay, I think we're all set, actually. Uh, how many... Just out of curiosity. How many of you um, saw all of the game today? <laughs> Man. And how many of you, like, kind of stepped in in the middle? And you're kind of feeling lost. Does the game have an epic final boss? Oh, you'll see. <laughs> yeah, this game, like, it's a product of its time, and, uh... God. Like, how can you... How can you replicate a game like this, in this day and age? You know? Uh, I got around the three hour mark and I have no idea what's going on. So, like, the, the whole premise of what's going on, your friends go to a horror-themed park and they're, they vanish. So you go and save them. We saved all of them. And then, you know, once you save, the, once you save them, there's a couple of levels you can do still. Just to, you know, get money while you're at it. There's a prize money in this park. And that's really... The gist of it. Can we see the... Wait, can we see the... Yeah, we can see them. So, there's the guys. The last guy, Jorg, is not um, her friend. He's just someone you find in the park, and then he, he becomes playable. So, Eriko is the protag, the main character. You can play as Kevin, Randy, Michelle, and Jorg. And yeah, um... That's basically the gist of the story. And again, this guy you just find in one of the levels and he becomes playable. But very late. Anyway, let's go to the last uh, bit, shall we? The Michael Reynolds Museum. Wait, just in case. Da -da 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 -da. Yo, Benji, how are you doing? So there's a bunch of items here, actually. Scapegoat Mary. Yeah, it's ending. Machine gun. Was there something else here, too? Like a shotgun, I think? Or maybe not. But yeah, they give you all of these items because... Um, 
It's basically the final boss. Uh, this is a Dreamcast game. So... You have a lot of res re references in this, actually. Not all of them, but... Oh no, man. Before Onomichio, there was Oh No Man. <laughs> oh, whoever came up with this. This is a Blue Stinger reference, if you couldn't tell. Bull Stinger. Keep your way, deep your body. What did they mean by that? Yo, Biggle, how you doing? Wait, what? Dolan... Dolanshur? Dolanshura? So this is basically Michael... No, wait, not Michael. Cashman, remember? We didn't get to fight him. Um, you can fight him. So basically what's going on here, you get to pick a boss fight. That's pretty cool. An eye test for some fucking reason. <laughs> um, cool. An empty board. Wait... Wait, that's not it. What the f- <laughs> Whoa, what is going on here? I actually don't know if this is intentional. Or if this is like a bug. That's spooky, actually. How many times have you played this game? This is my f second time. The first time I played this, I played for like half an hour. Uh, but I've watched this game like... Five times by now? Maybe more? Anyway. This is... Remember her? It's Eriko when she was little. Michael Orchestra. And my favorite. <laughs> but, for some reason. Elephant. Yeah, I... You know, I have no idea what... They were on when they made this game, but... Congratulations, fortunate visitors. You've managed to make it to the last room before you'll get out of ill bleed. A hundred million dollars awaits you if you can dollars. make it through in one piece. Ah, uh, 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 not so fast. I, Michael Reynolds, have a very special gift for you first. Uh, come, come now, don't be scared. It's just a painting. This one's by Stuart Milburn. Who's been my art director on the films I make? As you see, here is his signature. There are three paintings you can choose from, actually. So you can choose to fight him, or him, or Oh No Man. I'm assuming most of you guys don't mind Oh No Man. Maybe you'd like some help deciding. <laughs> the name alone is just worth it. Make your decision wisely, as you only. Get oh No Man, one. should we? Yeah, there's no sequel, unfortunately. This is a one and done thing. But man, imagine if there was. Oh no, man. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh shit. He's coming. <laughs> uh oh. Oh my god. It's oh no man. Yeah, so basically you can pick one between uh, those three. And you'll fight them. Wait, can I not hit him? Oh, there we go. He had iframes for a bit for some reason. <laughs> I can basically tank this with all the heals that I have. Oh, nice. Okay, maybe I should move a little bit. Yeah, this is what Dead Souls could have been. But hey, there's a chance with Dead Souls 2. He 
he's vicious. Actually, wait. Yeah, I don't know how to heal during battle. I think it is possible, I just... Maybe I didn't assign one button. So yeah, hold on, let me save here, just in case uh, I die. this slow and steady, we should do it without items. Okay. Oh no. Almost. Oh, and no, I'm starting to run slow now. What? How did that hit me? Almost. Oh, I'm I think I walked by mistake. Yeah, there we go. Almost. I think one more hit, actually. Oh! <laughs> nice. I haven't had this much excitement in a long time. <clears throat> Very well. I'm sorry to hear that, uh, Embry. One hundred million dollars. One hundred million. And here for the fanfare is the Michael Reynolds Orchestra. <laughs> the Bernie Sanders Orchestra. Look at him. <laughs> Bruh, this game. I'm a man of my word. Here. We're rich! Thank you, one hundred million dollars. Yeah, that was our real people, man. <laughs> All right, nice. Hope to see you again someday. Congratulations. Good luck. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I can't tell if this is just a poor horror game or shitpost game. It's both. Definitely. <laughs> yeah, that was the final boss. Oh! Story. Shinya Nishigaki. In memory of him, by the way. I think he passed away. He wrote an absolute banger of a story. God damn. <laughs> This song goes hard, by the way. I think there's gonna be one more cutscene after this. So, what do we think of Illbleed? Okay, honestly, I don't think there's a game like this. <laughs> like, ever. Yeah, I did save everyone. How many of you are watching this for the first time, by the way? Just curious. 
from what little I saw this game is big. <laughs> a product of its time, yeah, that's one way to put it. God, yeah, like, this game might not be the most fun to play. It was fun for me because I saw a playthrough of this game like five times, give or take. So I basically know what to do, where to go, in most places. So, th this was fun to, like, stream and show you guys. <laughs> yeah, what a trip. It's a trip. It's a ride. It's ill bleed. Yeah, and even those who tuned in, knowing the game, thank you. Sound design. The sound design is really good in this game. I've been in and out stream all day, and it looked different each time. Someone else said the exact same thing earlier. Motion capture. Uh, the thing about the secret ending is um, you can't do it on the first playthrough. You literally have to start the new game plus and play the game again, which is going to take a long time just to get the ending. So if you guys want to see the real ending, just look it up on YouTube. There's a video of it. I would basically have to replay everything for like a few minutes of cutscene. Man, who made this song? Sheesh. I think this is the last of it. I'm waiting for that cutscene. Sexy doll is the best part of the game. <laughs> oh, of course you would say that. Perverts. Oh, this music is going places. Crazy games. They are no more, sadly. Sega Corporation. <laughs> I need to know how they thought of this shit, Sam. Total money. Oh. Six hours and kind of a half. So here's the post credit scene. <laughs> How are we gonna spend a million bucks? Good question. I bought 385 different kinds of Freddy dolls. And I Freddy dolls? Not left. I invested in the stock market. You really trust the stock market? I don't know. I think so. Michelle is an NFT enjoyer. Erico, what's wrong? Oh, nothing. Never mind. She's probably in one of her philosophical moods. Hey, Erico, are you thinking of your secret love or something? <laughs> me, it's me. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't mind that at all. I'm going back to real bleed. What? 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 <laughs> what happened to Yorg? He just went out she of existence. Goes, I go. Thanks, Randy. But this time, I have to go alone. Why? What's going on? Kevin, butt out! She doesn't need a guy right now, okay? Wait for me, guys. If I make it back, I'll probably be a changed girl. We'll be right here, waiting and praying. I'm sure Pray. we'll make it through, but be careful and don't change too much. If you get into trouble, try and telepathically communicate with me, okay? I can be at your side in no time. Right. Thanks a lot, Dad. So if that wasn't a big enough of a hint I love you all. for New Game Plus, then yeah. That's the explanation, the, the lore reason for New Game Plus into this game. To get the true ending. Hey, my pleasure, Gory. The end. 
Man, what a game. What a game, guys. What a game. There we go. New game plus. Michael Reynolds Virtual Horrorland. Okay, that was Illbleed, fellas. Um, I hope you enjoyed this game. Again, I don't think there's any game like this. This is a one-of-a-kind game that I watched people play a lot of times and just, you know, I really wanted to show you guys this game. I think you can see why now. Um, this was really fun to play through. And I'm just thankful for seeing those playthroughs as many times as I did to be able to show you guys this game. But yeah, hope you guys uh, got something out of this. Hope you guys um, had a place to hang out today. And I... Yeah, Grammy, definitely. Um, I already have something planned for next time. And that also is going to be a ride. <laughs> a different kind of ride. But uh, actually, just a little bit similar. Anyway, um, if I don't stream tomorrow, it's going to be after tomorrow. Uh, but I'll try to let you guys know in advance by a few hours on Discord. But yeah, uh, thank you guys so much for joining. This has been amazing. You guys take care, stay safe, stay healthy. Um, have a great night or a sleep if you're going to sleep. And I'll see you soon. Bye-bye now, guys. Bye-bye.